show starts in five minutes. Fresh candies, all kinds, all flavors. Cigarettes, America's top brands. Ice cream, smoothly delicious. Burgers with all the fixings. Hot dogs, the way you like them. Freshly buttered popcorn. French fries. Hot coffee. Pizza that's perfection. Your attention, please. All new hotshot electric in-car heaters have been installed for your comfort and convenience. Just insert heater through car window and turn on the switch. When leaving, please turn switch off and replace on speaker post. Warning, high voltage. For your own safety, do not attempt to repair or remove wires. Do not attempt to open heater unit. If you need assistance, please notify the theater box office or concession manager. Show starts in four minutes. Visit our concession and see for yourself the delicious treats, drinks, and snacks awaiting you. If you are thirsty, try ice-cold soft drinks or a cup of hot, flavorful coffee. Get something to go mm, with what it, a like a sizzling and satisfying hot dog or a tasty, tender sandwich. Try one of these delicious treats, and you'll be back at the concession for more before the show is over. The service at our concession is friendly and efficient. Show starts in three minutes. The big ship foundered on the rocks, but the crew all got ashore. Then fearless Fred dived in again and swam toward the wreck once more. You'll never make it! The waves are too high! But he made it back to land. I had to return to the ship. He explained. For my toddy, the chocolate drink that's just grand. Toddy does taste grand. At the snack bar or at your car. During intermission, enjoy a toddy, the delicious chocolate drink in a can. Ice cold or steaming hot, toddy hits the spot with everybody. See how much better that popcorn or those hot dogs taste with toddy. Mm, what a hamburger. Mm, delicious. Show starts in two minutes. Class, come to order, pay attention just once. We have a lesson to teach to the dunce. <laughs> Is the candy good conviction? Yeah, the tasty is perfection. Have we got a good selection? We invite your close inspection. Is the ice cream not delicious? Health is tasty, unnutritious. Is the popcorn crisp and healthy? Yeah, and it is sure a mouthful. Is the soda cold and fizzy? Vitamins keep the bubbles busy. Ah, that's good. The lesson is learned. The trip to the sweet spa you have earned. Now is time for intermission. Treat yourself to some nutrition. Show starts in one minute. treat. The corn dog. Plump, juicy wieners are dipped in a thick, golden, southern style corn batter that seals in all their freshness and flavor. If you like hot dogs, you love corn dogs. Everybody does. Try a corn dog with your favorite beverage. At the refreshment corner now. 
corn dogs. And now, ladies and gentlemen, time for the show. Once again, thank you for coming to our theater tonight. Have an enjoyable evening. The refreshment stand will remain open for a short time. Still plenty of time to get a snack or cold drink. We'll make an announcement before the stand closes to give you plenty of time to get that last-minute treat. Good Monday. Everybody, how's it going? Oh, excuse me, one second. Hello. <laughs> Happy Monday, everybody. I hope you're ready to settle in for a nice relaxing stream. That is bright today. I actually have my window open so MJ can look out. Uh, I Today I will just be fishing in RuneScape. I just last night hit level 85 fishing. So we're gonna work on uh, we're gonna work on eighty six. Where did my uh, I need a little bit of a, a splash? There it is. Story recap. I'll, I'll consider a story recap. Didn't know there was a window. There actually is. So. I've got main desk here, right? Old desk up against this wall. This corner here is where my tiny CRT is for when I want to watch little movies. And then there's two windows. One of them doesn't get open much because it's a... Uh, it's got an AC unit in it. But the other one is for MJ to look out most of the time. She'll be here. She is here. She'll leave soon when she gets annoyed of me. Uh talking. Any snow, rain. It's been pretty rainy lately. No snow. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't I don't open it much because I do fear the sun. I don't like sun coming through window while I'm in while I'm inside. Oh, wow. Favorite brand of coffee? I forget the name of it. <laughs> it's uh Raven's Brew, I think is what I drink right now. I think we're going to swap to try a Costco coffee. Because you can't beat the Costco prices. Sad Gay Mothman, thank you for the three months. It's my 28th bidet and I get a stream. I'm so lucky. Happy bidet, Sad Gay Mothman. Cole is a bagel. Thank you for the two months. I'm obsessed yum, with your yum. Sims VODs, dear Lord. Oh, well, we will play more Sims. Uh... For sure, absolutely. Alex the Finn, thank you for the four months. Thanks for streaming at a good time for my part of Europe, Ian. I'll be crocheting along. What are you crocheting? Any, we, we get a lot of crocheters that watch. I wish I could see what's being croche, crocheted. See, MJ already can't take it. She's like, she's like, I gotta get out of here. I was... I was trying to, I was trying to sleep. Uh, Botany Nut, thank you for the three months. Odd Job 83, thank you for the nine months. And Cash Chew 968, thank you for the 200 bits. Uh, thank you for streaming on my birthday, Moose. Happy birthday. Dude, everybody's birthday, everybody's crocheting. It's a good day. She's like not at the door. She's just looking at me. So here's where I'm. Yesterday, I uh, I took some time to get all the video shit organized. I've been doing a bunch, and I, I felt sporadic. So I, I organized everything. Here's what I'm looking at uh, right now. <clears throat> this is the video uh, broken up into scenes, basically. So my goal today is to get uh yes I've censored the names of this I don't want to spoil too much today I feel like if I'm working on things I'll probably end up spoiling shit so I'm trying to trying to to keep it uh, light for now my goal is to get as many of these as possible to be ready to film I would love tomorrow to do 
a, a nice just filming day uh, where I can knock out a lot of this shit. So that's what I'm going to be up to. I mean, I'm not going to show off too much. You'll mostly be watching RuneScape, but I'm sure I'll talk about what I'm doing and and whatnot. You know, we'll see. We'll see. I don't do I don't do many uh, uh, work streams. Estimated release. Um, well, now that I've organized everything, I would say that this month is out of the question. I would like to get it. I think mid March would be if I could get it that weekend of the thirteenth, fourteenth. I'd feel pretty good about it. I really think uh, getting to the um, getting this next filming thing knocked out. Oh, sorry, April. You guys know what I mean. You know what I mean. Mid-April. Get out of here. It's me, Eric D. Thank you for the 24 months. You, you don't know what I mean? You could have figured out what I meant, I think. <laughs> I think you could have figured it out, but that's fine. Mid-April. April. So I said it wasn't coming out next this month. So you could assume that the month that I was going to be referring to would be the, the following month. But I, it's confusing. It's fine. I understand. Next month. So the, the weekend of that 13th, 14th, I think would be ideal. There's just a lot of a lot of stuff. All these uh, all these scenes are, are quite detailed. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! This is gonna go well. I can already tell that this is gonna go well, and I'm gonna get a lot of work, a lot of work done. Okay, MJ wants to go. Next month is Jazz Appreciation Month. Says who? <laughs> Says who? Wikipedia. Okay. Well, it's always something month. Who's going to go out of their way to appreciate jazz on Jazz Month? I feel like if you're going to observe that, you're already appreciating jazz throughout the year. I would... <laughs> I would think. Okay. Okay, let me look at my chart here. I gotta figure out what step one is for me. You refuse to listen to jazz outside of that month. I mean, that's kind of what it sounds like. Oh, yeah. Um, New survey at brutalmoose.com slash survey. If you would like to influence uh, Bingo XP, it's the final survey. Uh, you do have to log in to to Google to prevent uh, repeat repeat submissions on this one. Uh, but if you're interested in voting and letting your voice be heard, uh, brutalmoose.com slash survey. And that'll run through... It's, it'll run through uh, the week until we start on Monday. Monday is when we're starting bingo. Monday, 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 Monday 1. Monday, April 1. April the once Yeah, I just want your data. <laughs> give, me, give me all your data. So no Sims win. <laughs> win, Ch win, Chaka. So no Sims? We will play Sims again, yes. No Sims today, as I've said, it's RuneScape. And no Sims on Monday, as I said, it was bingo. Okay. Okay, so I got to figure out uh, no Chaka. There's no chance. There was probably a chance on Wednesday, but now there's not. I'm revoking the chance. I'm revoking the chance. I'm going to make all the money now. He's going to make all the money now. It's too late, Chaka. It's too late. That's what you get for, for pestering. Went fishing, got a boot. Sad Gay Mothman, thank you so much for the $20. 
Uh, I want to donate on my birthday, but I also want to say thank you. My mom passed last year after battling with ALZ for a long while. And listening to your streams helped me relax and sleep and take my mind off everything. So thank you, Ian. You've helped so much. Thank you so much, Sad Game Moth, man. I'm so sorry about that. Um, but I'm happy to, uh, I'm happy that you found some comfort in the streams here. We're always happy to have you. Uh, thank you very much. Is that, is that Thatch? Thank you for the two months. And Dochola Days. Thank you for the 14 months. Happy to get through a tough workday with some chill skate. Yeah, um, thank you for uh, anybody who's working along with me. I do have, I have a ton of clue scrolls in the bank to complete, but I'm not doing it. I can't do, well, maybe later. Maybe if I take a break, we could clue scroll. I got to get some stuff done. Here's, here we go. If I get some stuff done, I make some progress. Well, I'll take a, I'll take a break and uh, do something else in RuneScape for a second. But just for a second. Okay. So I got to get, I got to get the intro to filming. What am I missing on my intro? Hopefully this is all muted. I don't need you guys hearing, I don't need you guys hearing what I'm up to over here. Oh, oh okay. I need my storyboard. Storyboard paper. You can't hear it. Maybe, I mean, maybe if you guys are good, I'll I'll show off some stuff. But really, I honestly, I, uh, I've been working really hard on this. And I know it's it's been forever since the last upload, but I really, I really think you guys are going to like it. I'm really trying to make it uh, just crazy stylish. I need a pen. Pin. There's my free content. Can you hear one word? Not yet. Not yet. Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm going to storyboard the shots that I need for the intro. So, I'm going to write down what scene it is. I will write down what, uh, what, uh, I've, now I'm gonna, uh, okay, I, I won't, I'll try not to be too cryptic. I'll try not to be too cryptic. I need to write down what characters are on the scene because I need to know what, like, costume is involved. Because if I can get all these done, I can bulk film without having to change too much. I can knock a bunch of filming out with one outfit and then change when I got to do the other scenes. Yum, yum. Fuggle Pug, thank you for the four months. Hi, Ian. So the other day you streamed Mario Party on my birthday. Wanted to let you know later that night I got engaged. It was the greatest birthday I've had by far. Hey, congratulations, Fuggle Pug. That's exciting. Congratulations. Laura Shoes, thank you for the five months. Oh, and Fuggle Pug, thank you for the 245 bits. Stay awesome, Ian. Thank you for the chill content and cool vibes. Thank you so much, Fuggle. Congratulations again. Okay. Okay. I think I just need the one character to finish the intro, I think. Oh, wait, no. Oh. Gonna need more. Yeah, different care. Dream, Dream Bunny is all over this video, yeah. Definitely. 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 
I've spent a lot of time making what I'm calling like digital sets. Dude, it takes so long to build these things. Okay, so I need... One of my biggest challenges has been like walking point A to point B. My blue screen room is just enough for me to get like two, three steps in. So it's like, well, I need to walk farther than that. A digital set to me means a, a couple different things. Um, it's like, yeah, it is CGI, but I, I like to refer it as a digital set because, uh, you know, you build it like you, you build it like you would a set. Uh, some of them are Photoshop uh, creations that I um, I use stock photos for. Smush a bunch of stock photos together. I like them to look when you when I get it right, they look like. Uh, Oregon, Oregon trail cut scenes where they, they take the landscapes and kind of smoosh them together. And then I also like to do stock video for um, like grass moving or trees blowing in the wind called photo bashing. Okay. I photo bash. But it's kind of fun having limitations. I mean, the blue screen room is a little small, but anytime there's a problem, like how do I get from point A to point B? There's a creative, interesting way to do it, which could end up being more fun than just, you know, standing up and walking. Just going through all the footage I filmed for this scene. Photo Bash sounds like a Linux program. It sounds like something you would do in like Snapchat. Like I want to photo photo bash my hashtag or something like that. A lot of those. Oh, you want the stock breakdancing dudes? I'll see if I can get the stock breakdancing dudes uh, in there. Oh, I did do close-ups. Ah, I did do close-ups. Oh, that's too close. <laughs> uh, that one's a little close. Here, I'll, I can, I can, I can drop you guys occasional screens that don't. How is this close? <laughs> Just gonna leave that there <laughs> for what I wanna. Uh, look at you guys. I'm watching, so don't don't get up to shenanigans in there. You better you better be focused on what you're working on. <laughs> the wide shot. Hold on. I don't know. I, I don't know. No wide shot yet. That's all you get for now. That's all you get for now. I can't. I can't start showing everything. Oh, another uh, another digital set thing. I was talking about digital sets and how I I like to make them. Something I am trying this year. If you're on uh, my Patreon, you already know this. Uh, I I dropped some screenshots of works in progress. But uh, one of these scenes for this video is is a Unity scene. So I've built I've built a 3D space in Unity, and I'm uh, kind of like splicing myself in there. Oh wow! Because I've been learning Unity for a really long time and I haven't used it for anything. So I was like, I'll uh, I'll try for a video. I was gonna do multiple scenes, but I've never done it before. So, I'm just doing the one this time, and we'll see how it goes. Do you know how to use Unity? Look up, uh... Playmaker. I don't use Playmaker, but if I could start over, if I could start Unity over again, I'd probably learn Playmaker. I use Adventure Creator, which is sort of the same.
Working in After Effects is going great, actually. I do mostly in After... I'm using After Effects for... Um, uh, rotoscoping and some chroma keying. Because I, I have... Uh, I pay for the Red Giant effects, and they have a really good uh, key program for After Effects. I wish it was easier to put 3D objects into After Effects. I wish I could put, uh, like, 3D models that I make in Unity into After Effects, but it doesn't seem easy to do yet. Dude, Adventure Game Studios is pretty cool. I, I looked at AGS. Uh, when I first decided I wanted to make something, like <laughs> six years ago or something like that, maybe more, I uh, I did look at AGS. It's, it looks very cool. I think I'd have a hard time doing a 3D or a 2D game. I feel like 3D is easier to do like a low poly look, whereas if you do 2D, you gotta like be good at art. <laughs> you gotta be, you gotta actually be good. I've used I've used Blender. I haven't touched it in a while, but I, I'm I've used it some. Am I good at I'm I, I don't I don't know that I would say that I'm good at art now. I, I it's a it's a nice hobby. But it takes me five years to draw a picture, so I wouldn't personally say that I'm <laughs> wouldn't personally say uh, that I'm good at it. Thank goodness. Okay. See, this is why we storyboard. I thought I thought I, I I'm looking at a shot where I it's the back of my head and I stand up and I walk off screen. And I was walking off screen the wrong way. But it looks like I did both because I wasn't sure. <laughs> I wasn't sure which way to do it, so I just did both. Yeah, I am doing something else. I, I guess I could have added my uh premiere screen and maybe shrunk it real small or uh, pixelated it or something, but it's it's too late now. Just put it in reverse. I mean, I could flip it. I could just mirror it would be the easiest thing to do. That's flipping, mirroring footage is one of those things that no one would notice, but I don't want to do it because I'll convince myself that someone would notice. And even if you did notice, who, who gives a shit? Why would that <laughs> why would it matter? Ooh, put RuneScape over the playback screen. That's an interesting idea. You're not going to notice because I don't have to do it. You're not going to notice because I don't have to uh, flip any video because I, I was good and I, I got coverage. <laughs> if I flipped right now, maybe. I'll never tell. K's Lion Paws, thank you for the 15 months at work right now. Can't wait to catch the VOD later with my husband. Oh, it's going to be an exciting VOD, that's for sure. Mecha Bishi, thank you for the 10 months. Happy Chillscape, you moosey butt. And Mira, Mira Boo Doodles, thank you for the 11 months. Chillscape while I work, don't mind if I do. Hope you're having a killer day, Moose. I'm doing all right. I'm excited to be... Uh, Double dipping in the work today. Get a stream done. Get some get some video work done. I'm gonna I'm gonna feel good good today. Nothing makes me feel better than a nice solid day's worth of work. It's so nice. It's so nice ending the day and being like, I used that time well. Now I'll work on something else while I'm relaxing. <laughs> What is action action script? I, I actually I really do get I get extremely pissy if I don't get work done if I if I spend a day and I feel like I didn't make any real progress anywhere I am uh, I'm not pleasant to be around because I don't say anything I just sit there and stare off into space and think about what work I'm gonna get done the next day <laughs> I just. 
The action script is a programming language within Adobe Flash. Yum, yum. Are you learning action script now, or was the mis mistake of learning action script because it's they don't use it anymore? I am a little bit addicted. It's true. Uh, Real Big Salt, thank you for the 200 bits. OMG, I am going to be stuck in this office until I die. I hope not. Real Big Salt, you can you can make it. It'd be such a bummer to die in the office, you know? Wouldn't you rather die in uh, a nice field or something? I don't know where I would want to die. Actually, dying in the office, like, while I'm working? Never mind, that would not be a, 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 a bad way to go, actually. I'm going to finish my magnum opus, and then I'll just go, it's done, and then I'll die. I think that's how I'm going to go. Going to complete a full workday just to die. <laughs> well, we, we all have different relationships uh, with our work, you know? If I was working my, like, the phone job I was working, uh, my last real job, I wouldn't want to spend my last day working there. Die on stream or not? Mm. Sure. <laughs> Seems like a surefire way to get remembered. I mean, people would look me up every once in a while as as history goes on. Yeah, you can clip it. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> New bingo reward. By the time I get old enough and ready to die, there's going to be so many people that have already died. I mean, we're all going to get, we're all going to be grandpas. You know, there's older people than me streaming. They're going to, they'll, they'll do it first and they'll be like, it's so lame to die on, <laughs> to die on Twitch. It's been done before. <laughs> uh, Garglev, thank you for the nine months. Yeah. How, how unoriginal. I don't I don't want to die on camera and the people be like, oh, he stole this. He stole this. <laughs> okay. I got my computer running faster yesterday. I did something that I didn't think I would ever do. And I paid for the the pro version of C Cleaner. And I did like a big scan through the PC and I deleted a bunch of shit. And I think the most helpful thing it did was it let me put a bunch of applications to, into sleep mode. And I had all this crap. I mean, this computer, I've had this computer since. I mean, I built it for college. So uh, there's just so much crap <laughs> on here. And I put all these programs to sleep. I didn't even know we're running. I'm like, oh, I can kind of use my computer again. To be fair, I have not pay paid for CCleaner yet. I did the 30-day trial, so I could, I could, I could change my mind. But it was so, it did make a noticeable difference. I'm not, I'm not smart enough. I'm not computers, man. Some people know how to speed up their computer. I'm the dummy that's got to pay for CCleaner Pro to get it going <laughs> faster. It is like paying for WinRAR. I 100% I I agree. That's why I was shocked that it actually helped. Changed my mind and we're reverse back to slow. Fine, you're not buying CCleaner. We're, we're reactivating all these programs then. Okay. Man, I'm actually being able to I'm I'm able to run unrendered video with multiple After Effects scenes and I'm streaming and I'm playing RuneScape and it's actually kind of running. I mean RuneScape is chugging a little bit, but Was RuneScape chugging for you guys? It was chugging for me.
What up, Flippy Fizz? Yeah, I can have more than one nested sequence. My problem is not the more than one nested sequence. It's the nested sequence that's inside a nested sequence that's inside another nested sequence. They start being like, I don't like that. Stop nesting these sequences. Oh my god, I cannot wait for you guys to see my <laughs> my my various outfits. I always forget to nest sequences so you have a massively tall workspace. Yeah, I, I do both. I think that's pretty normal, Chaka. Cause some things need to be nested for a reason, but if I don't if I don't need to nest things, I try not to. Cause then you have to like go into the nested sequence to edit it. Mmm, what a hamburger. No, I, I only nest thing I only really nest things if I have a bunch of uh, effects or uh, layers stacked on top of each other and I want to like do a big camera pan in or something that's really the only time I I uh, nest do I use specific hardware software to catalog my games I use a, a, a site called Libib I, I don't know that I would write I would say shop around for media uh, libraries I, I don't I'm not positive that Libib was the right choice, but I've already logged everything, so uh, I'm not gonna do that again. So I'm I'm married to Libib now. Okay, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a render here. So if I start lagging, it's because I'm rendering video. How many sharks do I have? Let's we can check. I think I have seven thousand sharks. Am I wearing a bandana, a beanie? It's a bandana. It's a bandana, so my hair can come up. Oh, why'd I do that? It was nice and out of my way. Okay, I'm putting my hair back up. Do I plan to cook or sell? I'll probably cook. I'll probably cook. I can't cook sharks yet, though. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, what else can I do while I'm waiting? Here's a, uh, here's a, remember my, uh, my Bass Pro shop video? The scene where I, I pull out the gun and I shoot the eagle? This is the, this is the storyboard from that. There I am. There I am shooting that eagle. <laughs> Yeah, very professional. <laughs> yeah, the eagle. Uh, but let's let's zoom in on the eagle here. It's beautiful. It's it's beautiful. <laughs> it's a duck. I don't think I knew. No, I knew what I had. I think. I think I did storyboards after I got the food and the props. Yeah, it is illegal to kill bald eagles in America. I got I got a number of comments that were like, uh, "That's a crime. What you just did is a is a crime." And I'm like, "Well, it, I know it was a really really realistic effect, but it's a it was a stuffed animal." I think I'm just just too good. I just too I'm too. It, too good at editing. It just looks so realistic. <laughs> oh, let's, uh... I don't get my power-up sound? Oh, hey, I was this guy in Tower Unite the other day. No, new video is not out already. I'm I'm working on new video now. Well, I'm waiting for my uh, previews to render, and then I will go back to working on video. 
Apollo Rex, thank you for the five months. Back again with a resub. Also wanted to share that I constructed a corner in my house with a very 90s PC setup. Hell yes. Congratulations, Apollo Rex. Everybody should have a 90s PC setup somewhere. Why am I ignoring him? Because he's always bugging me. Also, I got this mask on. I can't hear shit. You still have your original 98? That's cool. Your dad promised XP PC for your birthday, but it's hard to find parts for one. I got mine, um... Here, let me, let me look up who exactly I got it from. I bought, I got a pre-built on eBay for fairly, I thought it was fairly reasonable. Let me, let me log in real quick. Uh, purchases. I got mine for 270. My my XP one that I've been using that I've really liked. I got mine for 270. From they still have. Oh, I don't know if they still have computers. Retro gaming PCs and thin clients. I don't know if that means you have to be thin to be a client. I wasn't asked if I was thin. Yeah, retro piece, retro gaming PCs and thin clients is the st <laughs> is the store that I use. Uh, yeah, they, it looks like they do make some smaller builds. The one that I got is sold out, it looks like. But I thought 270 was a pretty reasonable... Uh, reasonable price for one that works so well. It wasn't the most souped up. I mean, you can get some really souped up XP builds. I just wanted to get one that would run everything. I didn't need... You know, I don't need it to run Crisis a billion or whatever. Yeah, no one had souped up XP computers back in the day. I also didn't want to build my own because I don't know enough to build. <laughs> I, I don't, I'm not smart enough to build an old... I could build a modern computer, but I don't want to build a uh, old one. I feel like I should be doing something else while I'm waiting on this render. I feel like I'm wasting time. Um, let me bring out my checklist. What do I need? What do I need? What needs to get done? Push-ups? No. <laughs> no. Maybe my back roller. I, I have a back roller that I... I uh, I like to use. It's not really exercise, but it's good for my back. up my back out of spite. It doesn't need it doesn't need my help. It's fucked up enough. Is this what RuneScape is? Uh yeah. For me it is, yeah. I started playing again cuz I'm so excited for Brighter Shores. The new, uh, the new Gower Brothers game. 
I'm very, I'm very, very excited for Brighter Shores. I've not checked out Varlamor yet. No, not yet. I hear there's uh, there's some fishing though. I've seen I've seen a screenshot. I've seen a single screenshot, and it looks very cool. Uh, Brighter Shores is a brand new game, so the Gower brothers uh, aren't involved with RuneScape anymore. The the guys who made it way back when, and they're making a new. They're putting out a new game that they've been working on for like a decade, and it's it you know stylistically it's very similar to RuneScape. And it just looks, it looks like they just want to make a cool game. They're not trying to do microtransactions. Uh, or get big investors or anything. It just seems like they want to run a cool MMO. And I'm, I'm very excited for it. Okay, I can, I can make some, uh, some props. Gotta make a prop. New game requires membership subscription for P2P trading. It's not actually a subscription, uh, Byte Finnick. They, they, you do need a pass, but he said that uh, it's just going to be a, a fee. Yeah, I think it's a one-off one purchase. But it's, it's cool that they're still letting you do some free stuff before you got to buy. Yeah, I don't know about I, I don't know that they said no micro micro transactions at all. I can't say that for sure, but I know that they uh, they don't they they don't seem to be wanting to like uh, like nickel and dime you is is the vibe that I'm getting. The game is called Brighter Shores. If you go to the Brighter Shores subreddit, there's not a, a ton going on, so you can find all this. There's only been so much information that has come out for it, so. Oh, yeah, they're already rich. Yeah. Yeah. It looks like a time sink. It looks like RuneScape. I mean, it looks like... It looks kind of like RuneScape 3, only less bloated with stuff. Let's see here. How... Is that two by... My ruler... That's exactly what I was going to say. Two by five? Okay, two and a half. Two and a half by five. What game am I playing? I'm playing RuneScape. I'm playing RuneScape whilst I work on video stuff. Which, for now, is, is going unseen. What am I playing when I'm not streaming or working? I was playing the dot .hack games for a while. I was playing through the, the PS2 dot .hack games. I got to the third out of four. Haven't played in a while just because I've been uh, really busy. Uh. How many dungeons have I had to redo? I've had to redo a few. Uh, I really want to get back into it, but all I've really had time to play is the occasional, uh, I'll hop in a, a game of Mario on the SNES, or uh, we started new Super Mario Bros, and so I'll play that for um, a uh, an hour or so. Might end up abandoning the games now after taking a break. Yeah, I, I hope not to. I mean, I took a, it's happened before, but I don't have enough time to... To play them, so there's, I mean, there's nothing I can, there's really nothing I can do, unless we want to move this video back uh, another month. If I can, if I can push this video back another month, I'll get back to work on the the dot hack games. Seven point six thousand sharks so far, by the way. My bank setup stresses you out. <laughs> it's a little chaotic in there. It's true. I don't get paid to play .hack. Not currently, anyway. 
<clears throat> I am going to cook those sharks. Oh my god. <clears throat> I am going to cook those sharks. I have to cook the other ones first though, like the tuna, the tuna and the whatnots. Yeah, I'm all right. I just got uh, uh, gunk, throat gunk. What's the medical term for th a throat throat gunk? Yeah, throat gunk. I don't like throat shit, no. <laughs> Uh, Radio Vidya, thank you for the eight months. Catch them sharks, Ian. And Titan Crimson 0416, thank you uh, for gifting that sub to Sentient Ficus. Okay, what am I going to make these look like? I got them designed, so I'm designing like a... Like a, like a fancy card that describes the food and it's held up using one of the things you might see on like a fancy table that you put the card in and it props it up. Does that make sense? Kind of like a menu card. Yeah, kind of. Use glue and glitter. That's that's uh, actually, you know, there is glitter involved in this. There is glitter. I've gotten glitter everywhere because of because of a specific prop. The glitter is more for Windows uh, or Bingo XP. Yeah, like the little spiral card holders. Yeah, exactly those. I also hate glitter. Uh, was a... Was a janitor, so I hate that I have brought this curse into my house, but... That's what the that's what that's what uh, that's what Michael's had for my prop. <laughs> that's what Michael's had for my prop. Sim City games. I have not put significant time in any Sim City. No. Bum bum bum. What are the odds that I can get to 86 today? Slim? Quite slim? Dickables, thank you for the 31 months. I just walked into us talking about throat shit. What the heck is going on? Well, I had some throat shit. Uh, that should be, that's descriptive enough. I got throat shit, you know? You guys want to Hop around to a different... Let's just... Yeah. I'm sick. No, no, no. I'm not allowed to get sick. No getting sick. That's not totally true, Mo. That's not 100% true. If I'm sick, I can't I can work. It just it just depends on uh, how willing I am to put up with like the the look from the boyfriend when I say I'm sick, but I'm going to go to my office. I have to be able to to handle the expression that follows that exchange. <laughs> 
Uh, and sometimes I can handle it, and sometimes I go sit down on the couch. <laughs> just, it just depends. Sorry, I'm reading, uh... I'm reading reviews for one of these foods I'm gonna review. I should mention that I still have not filmed any food eating in this video yet. I'm I'm that far this far along and I still have not eaten any of the food. <laughs> it's gonna be a great food video, yeah. I'm trying to get I'm trying to get all the stuff in between first, because uh, honestly, the eating the food is going to be the easiest part. I mean, it's the mo it's just brain dead. Just shut your brain off, eat the food, and go. Oh, this tastes so good, or oh, this tastes so bad. So I can do that in my sleep. Brutal food review where you don't eat the food. Don't tempt me. <laughs> don't tempt me my least favorite food video i don't know i'd have to i'd have to look at a list of them i'd have to look at a list honestly what i'm most worried about is people not liking the extra stuff, because to me, the extra stuff in the videos are, are what makes them fun. So if I get a ton of comments that are like, just get to the food already, I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to make fucking lose it. Okay. I just want to see you chew. <laughs> I think it's gonna be good. I think it's gonna be good. I wish it was done, but other than that, I'm really not I'm not that concerned. I think it's gonna I think it'll be a crowd pleaser for for many reasons. My least favorite would be the Hungry Man Chicken. Oh, you mean like the, the my least favorite thing that I've eaten on a food video? Probably the banana with mayo or whatever. Okay. Well, I think... I'm done with this part. Oh, oh, my render preview stopped. Goshu's yogurt was pretty bad, but I mean, the the mayo and fruit it was in inedible. I think that was the only thing I didn't actually did I did I swallow a bite of the mayo fruit? Oh, why the fuck am I flickering? Why the fuck am I flickering? What the fuck? They just disappear for this frame. What? Uh, hmm. That's not. <laughs> that's not good. Uh. Why do these videos take for fucking ever? I get the I get the effect perfect, right? I get it totally perfect. And then I reload, I reopen Premiere, and something's wrong. Something is not right. Uh is that part of the effect. It's now my ancient it's definitely not the ancient PC. Well I so I I rendered out um my intro 
And for some of the blue screen shots, I'm like I'm just flickering in and out of existence. So I'm gonna hope that if I open these. These files. I'll stop flickering? Okay, let's try that. I'm still not totally uh, used to what they call dynamic link, I'm pretty sure is what it's called. Where you, you, uh, you send a clip from Premiere to After Effects and you edit it in After Effects, but it reflects in Premiere. I've been getting weird issues like this and I don't really know why. Messes you up all the time. Do you feel like it's more accurate if you have the file open in After Effects? Yes, Lupin, that's exactly what it is, yeah. Might fix itself after a final render. I can't, uh... I can't bank on that. You keep it open in AE and it seems to help. Okay, well, that's what I did. I just opened the After Effects file and I'm re-rendering, so we'll see. Um, I do have the... Premiere subscription. I have uh, I have the Adobe whatever. I have all the Adobe shit. Now, once I am done with this video, I I would I'm not opposed to going through it after it's out, and uh, you know if if someone wants to know how I did something, it could be fun to to poke around. I don't think it's five hundred a month. I think it's closer to, to like. Eight is it eight five to eight a year eight hundred a year? It's expensive, but I mean it's it's where I make all of my all of my money. So I invest a, a lot in softwares, and softwares are all like subscription based now. It's a ripoff. So it goes. I could, I could be spending that money on a CC Cleaner Pro subscription. It's true. Ever thought about going Mac? I've, I've edited on my Mac before. I have a, I got an Apple M1 Mac, and I was doing a, uh, I did a number of videos on that one. But I moved back because I did kind of like the home, like the station, and and having my, having my Premiere timeline on a laptop that I could bring anywhere, was not. Uh, ideal for me <laughs> it was uh, creating uh, problems so it's better to have Premiere in one place and not somewhere I can take you know anywhere I want it no the problem was not stopping work the problem was oh I'm doing all this work I can just move to the couch and I'll uh, I'll just keep editing on my on my laptop I've heard mixed things about the M3 chips. Are, are people liking the M3 chips? I heard mixed things when they came out. Okay, I can check off, make those... Oh, wait, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look for reviews a little bit more. M3 chip is good, but it wasn't that much better than M2. Okay. Yeah, I was hearing people I was hearing people say to just stick with the M2s. Are any of them part of the promotion? You know, with these food reviews, uh, these uh, like online reviews of food, you get a lot that come from a website called influencer.com. They must give you like 
points or something for reviewing things, but I'm suspicious of anything that's coming from Influencer.com. Because a lot of them are, are very positive. A lot of them are like glowing five-star reviews. Yeah, terrible, terrible website name, yeah. No, I'm not an influencer, no. Yes, yeah, he five star, five star, five star, all these influencers. Five star, five star. Five star, five star. There's no way these things are going to be five star. I don't believe it. Is that where I go to figure out the different strains of the flu are? Influencer? Oh, flu. I gotcha. I got a flu shot the other day. I haven't had a flu shot in a long time. I went, I went, uh, I went for a checkup. And they were like, you want a flu shot? And I said, I guess. And that's my story about how I got a flu shot. How did I feel after? It was fine. Not as I feel like flu shots used to be more painful. I expected my arm to really hurt, but it was fine. Thank you. I tell really good stories. I live a very exciting life, so I always have really exciting stories like that. Oh, this is actually, this is a good review. I'm gonna take this one too. I got an email from some, uh, some uh, some business that sends influencers on trips and like pays them for it or whatever and they're like well we'll pay you to go on these trips why don't you want to go on these trips and I'm like that that sounds like a, a whole to do <laughs> can I just can I just have the money and not go where do they want to send you I don't know they just want to send I think they just want to send you wherever I don't want to go anywhere. Rapidly becoming the next PewDiePie. I think to be the next PewDiePie. I think I think to be a big creator or influencer, I think you actually have to accept some of these opportunities and not turn every single one down except for HelloFresh. <laughs> Would I go on a Domino's branded influencer trip? Maybe. Where, I mean, where are they sending me? Maybe. Why would they want to send you on a trip? Their, their company sends people on trips. I'm assuming they get paid from the places you go. I'm assuming it's like to encourage tourism or to encourage other people to go. I think it's just how vacation destinations are advertising now. They send influencers to go so that all the people watching are like, ah, well, I gotta go there. Oh, it'd be so nice if I was there. And they probably say, well, don't say anything bad. <laughs> don't say anything bad while you're on your trip. Just have fun and talk about how much fun you're having. I'm hoping this render goes better. Don't talk about piss challenge yet. <laughs> exactly. No, I wouldn't be fit for a job like that now. I can't I I couldn't A lot of the a lot of the brand deals. I don't turn down many brand deals anymore because uh my my brand deal people have just stopped bringing me stuff that they know I will say no to, which is almost everything. Um but so many places would be like, well, you can't say bad things about that. Well, you can't you can't really give your opinion on it unless your opinion is this is awesome. So it's like, well, <laughs> I guess I'll only advertise something I think is pretty good then. <laughs> I 
<laughs> but only talk to Piz Chat. That would be really funny. T take the influencer people up on the trip and just talk about the piss challenge. <laughs> so I'm at this great resort here in Malibu doing the piss challenge. <laughs> the hotel bathroom. Oh my God. That would actually be hilarious. Go on a really fancy trip, and the only thing I review is the quality of the bathrooms. What's the piss challenge? Well, we'd have to figure it out on the way. It'd be like, how many times can I piss uh, on this trip? I'm just constantly chugging water trying to, trying to piss more. I like I like the idea of just going on a really going to a really bougie location and only talking about the restrooms. I actually think that that would be uh, really really funny. And set it up as just a regular like travel vlog. Don't say you're only going to talk about the restrooms, but then uh, just once you after you get on the airplane, that's all you want to fucking talk about. <laughs> oh, that'd be great. Okay, I, the render's taking a lot longer this time. I'm hoping it's going to be good. Okay, we can check. Check that off. I have some things I need to print. But I guess I can't show you those things, huh? Well, I'll consider that. I'll consider that uh, in the future. Okay. Okay, let's take a break there while this is... While this is rendering. I, now I really gotta pee. I think between the coffee, the sound of the fishing, and the just the line of discussion now, I for some reason I really gotta go. <laughs> here's uh here's a new song. Alone. That'll be appropriate because I will be uh, using the restroom. I'll be I'll be right back.
it's hot in here. Go away. You guys are all over the place. I feel like here's here's my here's my criticism. Here's my criticism of when I get back from the bathroom. Hand washing questions aside, it's always oh that was so fast or oh that took forever. Why is it never oh that that was the perfect amount of time to be at the restroom? You really nailed that one. That was the that was the perfect amount of time to be gone. How about some encouragement here, huh? I, I got I got pee fuel, so I'll be going again, and you can step it up next time. I need to feel validated about how long I'm in the bathroom. This export's still <laughs> still rendering, by the way. Thank you, Lupin. That was a great, that was great. Oh my God. I timed it and that's exactly how long I would have spent in the bathroom. <laughs> Good job. Okay, I've got all this shit. I'm surrounded by shit. I'm gonna clean up my desk a little bit while I'm, my render is rendering. Uh, anybody like to chew gum? Any, any gum chewers out there? I've become quite a gum chewer. Lately, I've got some Orbit Bubble Mint on hand, ready to go. Love chewing gum. You end up chewing your tongue more than the gum. <laughs> I love the bubble mint, yeah. It's been nice, like... I was kind of warming up to the idea of, like, fidgeting to keep a hand busy like this, right? But I need both to work. This doesn't... This this works a little bit. But chewing is like, okay, it gives me something to do while I'm doing something else. Switch to mints. I have mints as well, but I like to chew... I like... To, I chew on the mint, and I shouldn't. I don't think I have ADHD. There's no sign... There's no signs. There's no science. Yeah, don't do it. don't diagnose me. If I don't get diagnosed, that means I don't have every anything and I'm totally normal. Okay? Okay, okay. I gotta board I gotta board this shot before I forget. Not that I would forget, because I remember well. I remember... What was I talking... What was I saying? Hold on. This looks fucking terrible. Oh my god. Like a two-year-old drew it. Uh Okay. What was I talking about? I was talking about something about remembering. <laughs> something about remembering something. Um, okay, medium shot. Uh, I need a table. Hands on table. Oh, thank you, Snooze. Yes, there is, uh, there is another survey for Bingo XP. Uh, let your voice be heard or, uh, you're not allowed to complain about anything when the when the season happens i'll say did you vote and if you say no i'll say sucks to suck dude it's 
the yeah. ambient jungle. Where's your sticker? You uh, you gotta you gotta make your own sticker. You allowed to complain if you vote. Your complaints will be more valid if you vote. I still might tell you to shut up. <laughs> Uh, do you need to submit to m most answers or only one? You can pick as many as you'd like. Uh, on the, the current survey, check as many as you like, or you could just check one. I guess you could check none if you wanted to, but that's, you might as well not even, <laughs> not even vote. Thanks, Ribbons. I really need to update my guestbook. I manually do all the guestbook entries, and I haven't had time to... I need to write a blog, too. I haven't I haven't blogged in a little while. There's so much... There's so much to do. Okay. I can't check my scene because of the render box, so I don't know... Don't know that I can. Hire <laughs> Ben and Loop and do the busy work. It'd be interesting to have a, a, like an official assistant of sorts. I don't know that I would like it. I think I now I'm I'm trying to just lean into the chaos of how I operate. You know, I blog when I feel like I got a blog. I video work when I feel like I got a video work. I feel like if I had an assistant, I would spend time, like, delegating shit. And I wouldn't even offhand. I wouldn't even... I would be terrible at saying, hey, could you do this for me? I would just be like, ah, I don't want to busy <laughs> that person I'm paying. <laughs> Charred Monster, thank you for the 13 months. Everyone, please vote for Baldur's Gate. It's time to role play. Ooh, some campaigning for the survey. I like it. A uh, new survey at brutalmoose.com slash survey. I'm just going to use that URL as a, uh, whenever I have a, a survey or, or something going, it'll that's where it'll be. <laughs> Thank you, Danny. I'll consider it, Danny. That sounds like a good deal. I'm so excited for Bingo. Like, really, really excited. You guys can kind of see a little sneak preview up here. This is the new, uh, this is the new Bingo board. It's not, it's not sitting on a table anymore. Up, up out of my way. And then, uh, the winner's lounge is over here on the shelf. So I don't have to do any additional tables, which I'm hoping means it can live there and be out of my way. How do I blot it? Well, you'll just have to tune in and see. I'll just, I'll just hit it with a, 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 a dow, a dauber. Eight bit kitty cat, thank you for the forty two months. Don't vote for Baldur's Gate. Eden will be miserable. Actually, do vote for Baldur's Gate. <laughs> thank you, eight bit kitty cat. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, we're at 91.2%. Uh, what else can I do? I feel like I want to... Maybe I should just clean. Oh, you know what I need to do? Oh! Ah! Ceiling bingo board? I wouldn't be able to reach... I like the idea, but I wouldn't be able to reach. I need to put all these uh, these PC games that I got from the last fan mail haul, I need to put them into the, the correct binders. I really don't want to do that, though. It's going to be such a pain in the ass. I am 6'11", it's true. God, I don't want to do that. Maybe that means I should. Somebody, uh, it's not, 
I don't think it's Rick Rubin. One of my uh, one of my self help people says that if it, that you're supposed to do the one thing that you don't want to do the most is the thing that you're supposed to do, like not in general in in your uh, in your work. Fuck. God, I don't want to do this shit. I really don't want to do this shit. I like to organize shit too, but here's the thing. I have been continually organizing these games just nonstop. Now, since I started doing Libib, whenever I started doing that, I have not stopped organizing these games. Yes, it is a different survey. There's a survey number two, the final XP survey. Okay. It is called Eating the Frog. I have actually I, I loaned the book to my boyfriend, so I don't think I have it here. But I did read I did read a book by uh, Brian Tracy called Eat Eat the Frog. I've read a number of uh, like self help productivity books over the past few years just because I uh, got had had a problem with uh, staying productive like just wheel spinning you know like I'm always working but I, I feel like I'm not getting anywhere sometimes so I've read a number of books about any I can recommend I did like eat the frog um, I'm reading one that's more about meditation currently oh, I don't remember the name and I don't see it so I don't know where the fuck it it is Oh, I think it's called uh, Wherever You Go, There You Are, I think is the book. And I, I picked that one up because I'm reading, uh, I'm in the middle of uh, still reading this one. Oh, you can see Joel McHale peeking out from when I went and saw him. I kept his flyer. Uh, the Creative Act by Rick Rubin suggested uh, that book. Get it, get it, get it, get it. So I picked that one up. This one's really good if you... If you uh, are a creative and you like thinking about making things creative. It's all just like musings about the creative process. Very uh, inspirational. Called The Creative Act by Rick Rubin. Hi, Minota. Good to see you. Thank you so much for the 93 months. Heyo, Ian. Have you heard of a 70s game show called Bozo Buckets? A show about throwing balls into buckets and hosted by two clowns who seem rather unprofessional. I have not heard of Bozo Buckets, but it sounds awesome. Oh, you saw the book at the bookstore? Creative Act? Yeah, it's pretty new. I think he just put it out last year or something. It's been good. I haven't finished it, so I can't say 100%. But it's so far, it's been nice when I feel stuck and I want to feel creative. It's been nice to pick up and read a bit. Four thousand weeks speaks about my mortality as being human and having limited time on Earth. Oh my God! I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that that's what I want to think about. I want to think about getting things done. I don't want to think about. Uh how my time is limited I mean I guess those I could see how those things are connected I just don't want to focus too much about on that. okay let's okay I'm gonna put these encyclopedias in the software stack not in the game I'm trying to separate my games and my softwares which is not something I used to do Okay, let's see. My render's done. Let's see if I'm flickering. And by let's see if I'm flickering, 
I'm going to see if I'm flickering and I'll, I will relay that information. Okay, it's fixed. I just had to open After Effects, I suppose. Oh, you finished your work? Congratulations. I'm still working away. Working away, just hopping around. See, now I have all these... I'm ready to do more video work, but now I have all these fucking computer games in front of me. Barbie software for girls. How long has it been? Oh, it's already been an hour and a half. Hold my fucking... Okay. Dude. Why does time move so fast? It takes like 15 to 30 minutes to like render previews. That's part of the reason the shit takes so long. I'm always waiting on render previews. That's why I keep talking about maybe upgrading my computer. It seems excessive, but if I could if I could drastically lower my render times, oh my god, I could speed up everything. <laughs> Just think of their mortality. I'm going to die before I finish this video. Best Little Debbie is? Ooh, a Little Debbie food video would, I mean, it would be delicious. I don't know that it would be particularly fun, but for me, I would get to eat a lot of tasty treats. Oh, Christmas tree cakes are a great choice. Okay, Wrestling Encore, Drop, Backyard Baseball. Oh, this one, this one I'm still pretty interested in. This, I want to do the White House. I feel, I feel like the White House is a really funny place for what I'm assuming is a hidden object game. <laughs> Maybe I'll save that for election season. Find the classified documents. I haven't tried... No, the Little Debbie ice cream... I haven't tried any of the... the Like the branded ice cream that's that's really... Uh, I don't know if they're trendy, but I see them in the Frozen section. There's like Snickers version. There's, every, there's Reese's version. There's... Everything's an ice cream now. I haven't tried them. I like... Uh, Ben and Jerry's. I almost call it Dave and Buster's. I like Ben and Jerry's. And Tillamook. Tillamook ice cream sandwiches. Oh! Can't wait till it's a little warmer. Tillamook ice cream sandwiches. Oh! What is an ump umpqua? I'll look it up. Umpqua? It's a bank. Umpqua Bank. Oh, ice cream brand. Okay, let me put ice cream. <laughs> okay, yeah, okay. Umpqua, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I recognize this. Ooh. Oh, it's sherbet. I was going to say orange ice cream. Orange sherbet makes sense. Thank you, everybody, who has uh, responded in the bingo survey already. We already have 82 responses, which is great. Um, the last survey, we got 70, 700-something submissions. 
which you were able to submit as many as so it wasn't 700 people but I, I was very surprised at how many submissions there were I wasn't sure how many people would do it okay I need to figure out so here's here's the situation here's what I'm doing right now with, without being too specific I'm working on a scene where uh, character A is is seeing something on TV and I gotta figure out because I did the th I made the thing that is being on seen on the television but I gotta figure out where I'm gonna slip in like reaction shots like I need shots of me like looking up at the TV looking at the you know behind the shot looking at the TV but I don't want to break up I mean I made the thing I made the broadcast so tight that I'm not sure where I'm gonna put those in no no televoid I'll, I'll squash that one right now no televoid Because it's like first shot is is me next to the TV, then it's TV. So now I need a shot. I'm like looking at a book, so I need a shot of me looking up, looking up from the book would be the first. Is Televoid dead? I don't know, man. Televoid lives inside us all. Maybe I just haven't made any in a while. Am I recreating 2008 YouTube skits? I do think this will have an, an older YouTube video uh, feel to it, which I hope it's... I hope it's modernized enough to be entertained. That's the thing. That's the thing, is I could see people watching this and being like, ah, oh, this is cheesy. This is dumb. But... We're just going to have to see. I really don't know. I, I think it's going to go over well. But I really don't know. Thank you, Lupin. Thank you. It's too, it's too, I'm too far along to back out. So there's no there's no thought in my head about backing out. Because I, honestly, I like what I'm making. Which is the most important thing. So if people don't like it, that's uh, that's fine. But I think it's pretty cool so far. No, I don't I don't mean to seem down. It's just it's, you know, things you think about while working on something like this. It's hard, it's impossible not to think about it. Okay, I need built two angles of this room that I'm in. The problem is I need a third angle. It's really hard to do different shots of the same room when it's stock photo, man. Yeah, double stream. I think that's how it's supposed to be. It's you, sh you should, you know, pay attention to what your audience likes and dislikes, but ultimately uh, I think I think you should largely make things for yourself and uh, find the audience along the way, which is what I did. The problem is then I found the audience and I moved into a, well, how do I preserve this? How do I not let this die? You know, because it it wasn't just creative, it was also uh, my job, and that mixes in, you know, that, that complicates things. But I'm, I'm swinging back around. I think making, making things for yourself is, uh, that book, the creative act I was talking about, that's the kind of things that he talks about. Do, 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 do. 
but uh, this is going to be, I think this is going to be cool. And I don't think people are, uh, as far as I know, I don't think anyone's making something like this, which is what I like. I like to... Too, too much. I like to, to be unique too much. I should let that go sometimes, honestly, but... Yeah, I like to blaze the trail. No, I don't want to blaze... See, blazing the trail implies that I want people to follow me. I want people to leave me alone. <laughs> I can do my shit in private. Yeah, watch from a distance. It's a, it's a complicated relationship, okay? It's a, it's a complicated change going from I'm just making things from for fun to I gotta pay my bills with by making some things. Opposite of a trendsetter, be like a trend follower. I've just always. I've just always told myself that I'm just a hipster. I just feel like these are all just hipster feelings that I feel. And I'm fine with that. There we go. innate desire to do things other people aren't doing. I think that's good. I think that's especially if you're if you're creative, that's kind of where you want to be. You want to see what's out there and uh offer something else. Who's screaming at my door? Doesn't that make me unrelatable? Relatable to... To huh? I don't really care to be rel relatable. <laughs> I don't really care if I'm relatable, honestly. A lot of people's... A lot of people... Uh, nowadays seem really concerned with relating to the like media they consume and being like I see myself and I have to be able to see myself in that or I'm not gonna like it and that's just not I don't I don't care <laughs> I just, I just don't care Okay, okay. So I'm still in Photoshop. Just as an update. I'm still in Photoshop. I'm going to work on this. It's a background view for a shot. I've got two side shots. I need the straight on what's happening behind me. Uh... Base cam's bright. Yeah, my, my window is open. Ooh, it's raining. MJ's up to shenanigans. She wants to play, but she's going to have to wait. I love the rain. It's been very rainy and gloomy in a way that I like lately. I want the, I want the heat, too. Like, I want the nice weather, too. Mainly because I want to go work in the yard, but uh, if I get the if I get the nice weather now, I can't enjoy it because I I'm I got to do this video. 
so it should stay gloomy. Oh my God, yeah, she wants out now. Rainy working days are nice. I might even open my window to hear it. I wonder if it's... I wonder what the temperature's like. Can I direct some of the gloom and rain to Oklahoma? When I'm done with this, when I'm done with this video, I'll, I'll do my best. Right now I need it. I, I, need, I need the rain. It powers me. Okay, so we're gonna do... I need like a doorway on one side and like a window with curtains on the other. Oh, why did I do why did I do this to myself? It should have just been a room with no features. If there's room with no features, I don't have to recreate the features for the different angles. I also love the Washington weather. I love the gloomy weather and the really nice summers. It's a little too cold. I wish it uh, wish it was a little warmer, but other than that, I'm, I'm enjoying it. Ignore continuity. I largely do, but it has to be... It has to be close enough to where you don't think about it if you're uh, watching it, you know? Uh, yes, there is an official start date. We are starting bingo next Monday. Next Monday. Monday, Monday. I don't have a time for it, but it will be... I will start in the morning. Uh, Big Law, no, I have not been to Varlamore yet. No, I've been hearing about it, but I have not yet been. It's not an elaborate joke. No, it's just unfortunate timing. <laughs> it is It is not an April Fool's joke. Though the, the good thing is, if I do have to bail for whatever reason, I'll just lie and I'll say it was an April Fool's joke all the time. No, it's going to be Monday. I already plan on Sunday to spend the day just doing any last minute thing I haven't done. Uh, but it's it's pretty much ready to go. I need to pick the games uh, to be matched with the numbers. I only have some games picked so far. Uh, oh, I have a list. Hold on, where's my list? I have to... I got to make my scenes in Streamlabs. I got to finish doing the mail, the mail videos. Oh my God, Brutal Mails. Just fucking... Oh, should not have done it. <laughs> should not have done it. I don't know what I was thinking. Well, I know, I know what I was thinking, but it was a terrible idea. It was a terrible idea. I got to get the TV going for the Winner's Lounge... And then I got to write out the rules. So really not too much. Editing the mail videos is going to be the, uh, probably the biggest time sink out of all those. It was a good idea. I just don't know how, where I thought all this editing time was going to come from. I mean, I had some help with the editing, but I didn't realize how much the, the finished edit would take. Yeah, 
out of my ass, yeah. I'm just not good at... I. Uh, my ambitions exceed my... Uh, how much time there is in a day. I, I always... I'm not good at estimating how long it takes me to do fucking anything. Anything. Next book should be on time management. It's not a bad idea. They're, I mean, they're kind. They're. It's actually there. That's pretty much what I'm reading. I mean, I'm reading books about productivity, which is time management. You know. Shit's tough. Let's change the song. I hope all you guys that are lurking and multitasking are being uh, very productive today. Thank you for joining me. I'm drinking the Raspberry Lemonade uh, G Fuel today, or for now. I don't. I don't buy G Fuel by the crate. Just the. Just the tubs. I'm trying to write a thingy. What do you have to write? I'm trying to find a door that will work for this stupid thing that I did. Just stupid, stupid thing. Oh, happy to happy to hang out in the background of anybody keeping me in the background. That's where I like to be. Keep me in the background. Don't pay too much attention to what I'm doing or saying. <laughs> New hunter stuff from Varlamore. I really want to go check out Varlamore uh, and fish over there. <laughs> want to go uh, want to go fish over there it's not working it's not working um Did you guys see that uh, that kick website signed like a fuck ton of RuneScape stream, like old school RuneScape streamers the other day? They signed a like a bunch of really big or a bunch of channels, and I know they signed Bodhi, who's like the big the big guy. Should get on kick. It's just so weird because it's like the it's like the gambling uh, plat streaming platform. So it's like, why are they targeting old school RuneScape streamers? Or do I don't know? I don't get it. Kick is bad for RuneScape community because gambling. I don't know about that, but it it definitely doesn't seem like I feel like moving platforms doesn't seem like it would be good for whatever community you, you've grown on one platform, you know? I mean, I would do it if someone wanted to, like, if Kick wanted to pay my house off. <laughs> then yeah, I'd probably do it. But I would not want to. Kick has a better split. I just... I. I just wonder I just wonder how many people would follow, you know? That's just too big of a question mark. Plus I like it here. Oh yeah, I bet I bet Bodie made bank. Oh wow. 
No, I'm curious as well. I'm curious as to what people like my like like my size channel uh, were getting. Again, not that I would want to do that. I would really prefer not to. Yeah, you can't bring your subscription streaks over. I'd have to change, uh, like, I'd have to change twitch.tv to kick. I mean, that would take minutes. Precious minutes. Yeah, I could be working on something else with those minutes. Uh, I'm not an Iron Man now. No, I'm a I'm a regular man. Moving to kick feels like a sell your soul type situation. I mean, that's what they did. Because uh, YouTube did that too at some point, right? Didn't they try and sign streamers onto YouTube Gaming or something? I feel like with a contract like that, you probably get, uh, yum, you yum. get, uh, like hours. They're probably like, you have to stream so many hours and do, I don't like being told that kind of, thing. I don't like being told what to do, whatever multi-stream, uh, I don't even know. Like, is that streaming to multiple platforms at once? Like streaming to YouTube at the same time? I probably wouldn't. Exactly, Chuck. I want to overwork myself on my own schedule. Sassy Glasses, thank you for the 100 bits. Cheers to cool new vids. I hope this one's cool. Uh, Res Sark, thank you for the 11 months. Pancake Batter Twitch, thank you for the 9 months. And Manukwone78, thank you for the $2. Have you heard that the Barbie movie got an Oscar win for best song? I have not heard that. Uh, I did not see the Barbie movie. I did not see the Oscars. Um, I did start watching uh, the Oscar special for this year, the on cinema Oscar special. But outside of that, I don't really, I don't really care. I have heard there's a new Sims. There's a Sims movie announced. It sounds dumb. <laughs> it just sounds like a stupid idea. Uh, be interested to see what they come up with for that. Are they gonna like? Are they gonna play the the families that were in? Like, are they gonna be like the goths and like the different families? I don't know. <laughs> gonna be in Simlish. It just feels like we're gonna get a ton of uh, like brand movies are gonna pick up. Dan we're done. We're done with the superheroes. Now we get the Marvel Cinematic Universe, or the Mattel. Sorry, the Mattel Cinematic Universe. Dude, this is not working. This is not working. But I, I, I'm an out I'm an outsider. I don't I don't really watch any movies, so you know, I'm just I'm just talking shit. I did see that uh, I think Christopher Nolan is rumored to be making a movie of the prisoner, which is that show, the 1970s show I was watching uh, a month or so ago, uh, which I think just sounds like another terrible idea. just not working. I'm going to have to find a different way to do this doorway. Oh, how does... Oh. 
How do I do a doorway? Ah! Oh! Ooh, yeah, if the Sims movie takes place in Shithole, then it, it, maybe it could be salvaged. Don't ruin the prisoner as well. They did already do a mini series of the prisoner that I read was terrible, so I guess it's already been ruined. The thoughts on Temporas. Temporas. That's the. Is that the fishing boss? That's pretty fun. I've done that. I've done that a little bit. Thoughts on Minecraft movie with Jason Momoa. Uh, I just don't care. I just don't care. I like almost don't even have an op an opinion. I just don't. I just don't care. I wish I did. I w you know, as someone who missed out on stuff as a kid, like big trends, because I wasn't allowed to. I always wanted to get into big trends later to be a part of the excitement but I just don't <laughs> I just don't give a shit uh, I have been thinking about maybe playing uh, Pokemon Red again because it's the one Pokemon I really liked That's about the size of a doorway. How big is a doorway? It's like big enough for a person to fit through. Retro, what's, which one's Pokemon Crystal? I've only, the only retro one I've played is Red. I played Red in college because uh, I was finally allowed to make my own decisions. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to play, I don't care that it's satanic. I'm going to play Pokemon Red. And that's where I met the devil. Constructing my own doorway. Crystal is Gen Two. Okay. I think I think I would try. Is Yellow the one that's uh, red and blue, but Pikachu follows you? I always thought that was kind of cool that he was he would hang out with you. And people like Fire Fire Red and uh, is Fire Red the one that is a remake of the first one? Yeah, that one seems like it'd be kind of kind of good. What a pocket bear! going okay we're chilling today i'm fishing some fish and working on video stuff that i can't show which hey by the way thanks guys for hanging out uh, one of the reasons i've put off work streams is because i i don't want to show the work i don't want to spoil anything so it's like well how the fuck do i do a work stream the answer is i just don't show anything i just, <laughs> just don't show anything at all so thanks for hanging out anyway. I'll I'll show I'll try and drop some uh, I'll try and make it worth your while. I'll try and uh, find some things I can spoil. But 
I think a lot of this I want to be a surprise. Oh yeah, I can do that. Are you focused on what you're supposed to be focused on right now? Are you getting work done? How are you spending your time today? Huh? Are you going to feel good at the end of the day with how you spent your time today? That's what it's like living in my head, actually. I that that those eyes, it's like a it's I don't see that in my mind, but I feel that in my mind. It's like my own self looking at me, judging what I'm doing every, every minute of every day. Should you be doing that right now? That's unhealthy. Oh, well, I didn't say it was healthy in my defense. I'm not saying that any of this is healthy. I'm just saying that it is, that's the way it is. I, 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 I kind of like it. <laughs> I'll be honest. It's, it, it's occasionally rough, but honestly, I like that. I like that I'm able to, to, uh, stay motivated to do because it is what I want to do I, I do want to make stuff I really just that's really all I want to do Where's my fish make the eyes my YouTube banner I'll consider it definitely hexadeca one of the reasons i'm so motivated is because i am you know i'm in a in a dream job scenario and uh it's one that you gotta you gotta work at to keep up so you know i could always go do something else and have less less pressure on me i could go get a, a different job and have less pressure on me but i mean then I would be working on somebody else's shit. Do you have the picture of my eyes? You want it to be a screensaver? I mean, you. I guess you could screenshot the stream. I can't stop you. Show you the eyes. I tried to... Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, I'll keep doing this job. I mean, even if I get another job, it's not like I would stop doing... I would still get home, and this is what I would... I mean, this is what I did before it was my job. I would just get home and, you know, work on this shit. So I need to chill out. I need to chill out. It's nice to have some pressure, but I need to I need to not put too much pressure on it and just enjoy the ride. It's hard not to feel like you got to keep up with everybody else making stuff. But dude, so many people making stuff have like full teams and you know, it's not it's not really good to compare too much of what other people are doing. So just enjoy what's going on now. <laughs> Mr. Beast number one rival. Yeah, that's me. Oh yeah, it definitely doesn't mean better. I mean, so that's the, that's another thing is when it comes to like YouTube and Twitch, you know, at one point when I started, it felt like, it felt like everyone most people were creatives trying to make something cool, but it's things are different now. You know, the money showed up and a lot of people are more business focused. They're not really concerned with what they're making. They just want to make money off of it. So it's really not healthy to, 
to compare that kind of a situation. Uh, if you are just trying to, to make cool stuff and, and not just phone it in and ring it for cash, it's not a good, it's not healthy to compare too much. Because, I mean, I'll never be able to keep up with that kind of output. It's just impossible. Thanks, Snooze. Now, I get, uh, I have to change what I'm doing or, or try new things or, like I'm doing now, I, like, learn new things and add things to, to my process. Because if I feel too stale, I just get stir-crazy. I, I feel like I'm going nuts. Did I ever notice the comments on my Dream Bunny and Fairy King of R videos from people involved with them? The latter has a comment from one of the main actors. That's cool. No, I did not notice that. I feel like maybe someone from Dream Bunny emailed me at some point. Oh, but that's pretty cool. Also, my doorway is looking much better. It actually kind of looks like a doorway now. question is what is the what oh Ugh. the Gerbert's creator have anything cool to say uh well so here's the thing people might rem someone might remember CJ remember that uh Gerbert's creator emailed me about a year ago now I took almost a full year to respond so I haven't heard back and it's probably because I took almost a full year to respond uh but hey doors open What would they say? Oh, he was just like, uh, hey, kind of, yeah, cool to, to see. I was just checking to see if anyone was talking about Gerbert and saw that you were talking about Gerbert. What's up, basically? A very friendly message. Um, and I eventually responded. It was like, hey, you know, hope you don't think I'm being mean to, to Gerbert. I love Gerbert. I sent some pictures of uh, the Gerbert stuff you guys have made and and sent to me, uh, but I don't I don't I don't typically respond to emails. I don't like I don't I, I just it made me nervous. It made me nervous. It shouldn't have made me nervous, but it did. Uh, emailing emailing the creator of Gerbert made me nervous. I don't know, just nervous. I can't say nervous for what. Just nervous. I'm used to I'm used to being left alone. Like any any anything that I like anything that disrupts my I'm alone uh, status makes me uncomfortable. But you know he could always email back if he wants. Email's not going anywhere. That's ne that's anxiety. I'm not anxious. No, I never get anxious. I don't have anxiety now. Mm -mm. Door. Herbert anxiety. <laughs> but hey, I did I did email back. Oh, that's weird. Sounds like you responding to text a week later like nothing happened. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I do that with Discord, too. People, I mean, you know, people will message. My friends will message me, and I'll be like, well, today's just not the day for a res <laughs> response. Just not the right time. Uh, maybe tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Mo knows. I agree. I think it should be more socially acceptable too. I shouldn't wait a full year to respond to Gerbert, but I'm I'm done with the idea that I have to be uh like available 24/7. I'm just I'm done with it. Cuz I I 
you know, I wouldn't respond and I would put pressure. You know, you put pressure on yourself even if you're not responding. Oh, I know, Mo. You you almost have to put up with that with me to uh, to be friends with me. You have to <laughs> you have to accept that I'm gonna disappear uh, into my work. Sometimes, sometimes I will just vanish into the work. Is that why we don't do Minecraft? I don't think that's why we uh, don't do Minecraft. I think me getting tired of playing Minecraft is much more of a, uh, more of a factor than, uh, not talking. Do I have ADHD? I don't know. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. I could go get that looked at at some point, but I'm not going to go do that. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not interested in uh, any sort of diagnosis or anything. I, I'm just. I'm just working with what I got, and that's 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 good for me. I need a wooden door. Or not, I should be proud of making this far in dot hack. I really do want to keep going on dot hack. I just need to find the time. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I I agree. Snooze. I I feel like I feel like uh, you know there there are there are good diagnose you know uh, so a lot of a lot of. Uh, a lot of diagnosis is di diagnosing, diagnosing happening without like doctor involvement. It feels like, and I'm not really, you know, you do whatever, but I'm not. I don't need a, I don't need a label. I just need to know how to work around it. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. No, you're all good. Low, low, lows. People attack life. Everybody does it a bit different. Not trying to judge, just saying it's not for me. Boom. Am I going to get Apple Vision? No. <laughs> no. What happened to Apple Vision? I feel like I I feel like I heard a bunch about Apple Vision and then I heard nothing. <laughs> I heard absolutely nothing. It's the first time I've heard anyone mention Apple Vision since like the week it came out. Oh yeah, Apple's getting sued for their their green text bubbles. <laughs> I don't even really get what the the vision like I don't I didn't I didn't what's the vision for the vision like what what was I supposed to be doing on the vision I've not seen the movie Blackberry but I'd like to yeah it's augmented reality so it's but like what where do you use where do you use that in a situation where you couldn't just yeah we can change songs no problem uh, where do would you use it in a situation where you're not just like sitting in front of a computer anyway saw someone wear it to his wedding well I'm sure he looked strapping as in he had a giant fucking thing strapped to his eyeballs Like going to the movies. I used to go to the movies a lot. I don't really go to the movies anymore. That would involve going. You know? <laughs> Just in general.
Like I'll go to to half price and I'll go to Costco, but do we re- are there really other places that I have to go? Can it not just be those two places? Oh, I do go to the bathroom. You know, I do have to go to the bathroom. Good idea, Chaka. I'm going to go pee again. And then I'm going to get back here and finish up this fucking doorway. I'll be right back. And remember... (laughs) Don't do anything I wouldn't do, okay? Because I'm always watching. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I really tried hard to do the appropriate uh, the appropriate piss time. I'm trying to figure out how long you guys want me to to take to pee. So I appreciate all the feedback. Too short? Okay. I'll remember that. I'll uh I'll pee slower next time. Yes, I wash my hands. I'm gonna fucking. I'm never streaming again. Spaz just wanted to make sure. How long does it take for you to wash your hands? Sing the alphabet twice? Well, I'll admit to not singing the alphabet while I'm washing my hands. I can't say that I sing the alphabet. Did I not pay attention during COVID? Of course not. Why did that get pinned? (laughs) Why did did you not pay attention during COVID get pinned? Pay attention to what? Yeah, I was already not leaving the house. I didn't have to do anything different during COVID. I just kept doing what I was already doing. I like this very tense song. No, I don't get groceries delivered. No, that's that's fair. I did go to the store. Favorite RuneScape song? I mean, it's... 
It's got to be Sea Shanty too. I, I, it's the goat. Everybody chooses it, but it's because it's so good. Oh, I guess people like flute salad. Sea Shanty Two is better than flute salad, so. Now I need to put a window. This is a little uh, aggressive for my, my... There we go. This is what the fish like to listen to. You know almost nothing about RuneScape. You know, there's uh, you can always start. It's it's always a great time to start. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, being dumb. Oh, dummy. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fixable. It's fine. Dummy. using much more aggressive language if I wasn't streaming right now. Uh, I have to play, you know, I gotta be the employee doing the thing, and then I also have to play the boss who yells at the employee when they mess up. You know, you gotta, you gotta yell at yourself a lot in this line of work, or you're not gonna get anywhere. <laughs> See a Dapple stream. Yeah, yelling helps with morale. Have I ever written myself up or given myself a pip? What is a pip? I know picture and picture. I'm currently I'm currently a picture in picture, really, because I'm I'm in the picture of the stream. I'm, I'm a pip now. I haven't written myself up now. I mean, not I don't write I don't write it down on paper. If you write it down on paper, HR is gonna see what I yelled at myself and report me. So I just think it real hard. <laughs> I, just, I just think all my feelings real hard. Oh yeah, I guess I'm also HR, huh? There's a lot of there's a lot of a lot of positions to be filled here. How does chat fit in? Like what role is chat? Uh I don't know. Would you be clients almost? You guys are not HR. You guys are bullies. <laughs> HR, H, in fact, HR has something as a message for you guys. Back off. <laughs> Have I ever given myself a raise? Uh, that's YouTube's job. YouTube gives me a raise by actually advertising my videos occasionally. Yeah, MJ's the CEO. Okay. I think this is going to work. I still can't... Maybe I could show... After I'm done, maybe I could show this off. We'll see. I really don't... I really don't want to spoil too much. And it's not the most impressive screen, but... We'll see. You don't want it spoiled either? We'll just see. Oh, I got a fish sharks. Oh yeah, I'll, I will jump scare again for sure. Absolutely. We 
we sing in Sillyville? I think someone sent that to me recently. Oh my god, what? I gotta change the song. It's gonna drive me crazy. It's gonna drive me absolutely crazy. Uh... Oh, yeah, this one's good. You were jamming. Maybe I'll maybe I'll go back to that one later. We'll see. I'll I'll consider it. Country past. I'm looking through this like stock photos that I've bought. See if I have a good window. And one of the windows I have is Santa peering. <laughs> He's peering through. Hold on, let me see if I can add Santa here and show you. <laughs> it's my favorite thing Santa does, actually. I've got there's a lot of there's a lot of good things to like about Santa. Um hold on. This one's this is my favorite thing about Santa here. <laughs> I love when he shushes. <laughs> <laughs> He's just here to give you a present. <laughs> That's my favorite. I don't have a I don't have a shushing Santa in my Christmas decor, but I want like many. I would love my house to just in Christmas every every time you turn a corner there's a Santa just <laughs> just shushing you. I'm now currently, I'm browsing Adobe stock photos for an acceptable window. I need a window that's gotta be kind of like, like long, like horizontally long instead of like a square situation. Adobe Stock is is pretty good. I like I like that you can search Adobe Stock in Oh, this one's perfect. In Photoshop is my favorite thing about it. You can Not only can you search Adobe Stock in Photoshop, but you can drag and drop previews into your project and and mess with them. And then if you like it, you can license license the image and it'll remove the watermarks without you having to redo all the shit you did to it, which I think is pretty cool. But on the other hand, kind of pricey. Does the AI generation in Adobe work well? Could you just have it generate stuff instead of using stock? I have been messing with that. Uh, uh, in this video in particular, to make uh, like generating landscapes with Adobe's generation stuff is pretty cool. I wouldn't want to do anything that's like generating an art style or something, but it, it really is cool when it comes to stock photos because I have I can give less money to Adobe because <laughs> I'm just you can just have it generate a stock photo of grass and be like okay, uh, now I have grass. It's interesting, though. Interesting. Oops. 
generative fill is, is pretty good to, uh, like, remove things from a picture. I feel like it's gotten a lot, a lot better at removing things from pictures, which is kind of cool. Okay, I do like this window. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy this window. It's a good window. Clean up cat photos with it. It's an interesting, interesting world right now. <laughs> Use it to add bleed. I found it's pretty good to, like, uh, when I make thumbnails for the second channel, sometimes I have the focus of a, a picture in the middle, and I still need stuff, like, where the, the seats are. I need it to extend out down a bit. Uh, and it's pretty good for, for that as well. Okay, this window's gonna work. I was definitely really spooked when all this AI stuff started coming out. But it's honestly, it's a lot, it's a lot more dumb than I thought it was, at least, <laughs> at least for now. I like to use chat GPT as a, like a Google. Now I, I use it to Google things. And uh, like, like the poll I just did where everybody listed games and stuff, I had ChatGPT tell me, like, make a list of uh, how many times each game was mentioned, which is something that would have taken me forever to do by myself. So it's got its... When used as a tool, it can be really cool. Uh, but it can also be really dumb. <laughs> it can also be really dumb. I've heard that uh, ChatGPT is getting it like you can use it to help code stuff. I don't know. I don't know enough about coding to know. Yeah, when you just stand in for a real person, it's it's pretty dumb. Like I don't. I'm not really impressed by you know if someone shows me a picture and they're like, I wrote the prompt that generated this. I don't. You know that's not impressive to me. But I do think it's it's got some pretty cool uses, especially for people that. Uh, you know, work alone and don't have a, a team to do stuff. But at the same time, it's really dumb. I'm, I was sitting here working on the door, the the door I was trying to make. I did the first thing I did was try and use the generative uh, AI to make me a door, so I wouldn't have to buy a door. But it didn't. I, it was too dumb. It was too, it was too stupid. All the doors looked really fucked up. So uh, I bought a door. Oh, I'm not fishing. How's Japan? You saw many dominoes so far. How much how much dominoes are you eating in Japan? I hope it's a lot. That's what I want to do when I go to Japan. ChatGPT isn't AI specifically since it's just borrowing content. The the label AI is is it just it doesn't really it, to me it doesn't mean anything anymore. Like the things are being called AI that that aren't AI clearly. Um so I, it, you know, just hearing that something is AI doesn't really mean anything to me. I have to know what it, what it, like, what is it though? What is it? Yeah. Like dumb AI we've had for a, a while. Yeah. Yeah. I think when, I think most of the time when I hear I, AI, I'm assuming it's like a generative thing like you're typing in a prompt and you're getting like a thing back
Yeah. Algorithm is AI. That's fair. I have AI. I mean, I pretend to be stupid, stupid, stupid smart. But uh, it's all just artificial. It's I'm not actually smart. AI is going through what the term hacking went through in the 2000s. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. I could see that. What is proper AI? I don't know, man. That's for uh, that's for the marketing team to decide. <laughs> that's for the marketing team to decide. Super Google's yeah, that's uh, that's like I was saying. That's how I use ChatGPT the most. Is I, I use it as as Google. No, it was actually, honestly, I, I didn't do any, I didn't do any, like, AI anything when it was first coming around. I was very against it. And then when I finally fucked with it, I'm like, wait a minute, this is dumb. <laughs> this is not able to do what I want it to do at all. I was watching an old DVD sorting stream, and I was like, when am I going to watch her again when AI becomes a thing? Where was AI at when her came out? Okay, I need like a wood texture. I don't think I remember Smarter Child, no. Is, uh, is facade, is that AI? Do we count? Are we counting that? Sometimes when I use chat GPT, it feels like I'm playing facade again. That's how dumb it, <laughs> how dumb it is at times. Oh my god, I do remember Cleverbot. I do remember Cleverbot. I feel like Photoshop is constantly changing whether or not you hold shift to do... like to scale things exact or to freeform scale sometimes i hold shift and it's freeform sometimes i hold shift and it's exact and it drives me fucking crazy drives me crazy just pick away thought it was shift for exact i'm telling you it it changes for me it changes for me sometimes just the other day it was doing exact if you don't hit shift you had to hit shift to do free transform and now today it's doing the other thing i'm telling you it changes it is it is at least changed for me i wonder if there's some setting that i saved once and it keeps loading that setting that I never use. It's shift on Illustrator and nothing on Photoshop. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's changing. Has an Adobe update ever ruined a project? It sure has. So I try not to, I try not to update anything Adobe when I'm in the middle of a project.
so I never update. I update occasionally. I last time I updated was to get the uh the AI audio features which is like text or speech to text which has been around for a little bit but I suppose it's AI. I suppose it's AI. Got tired of Adobe's bullshit with Photoshop. Moved to Affinity Photo 2. That's pretty cool. I'm too like it's they've got my they've got their hooks in me. I feel like I can't leave Adobe. I'm 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 just gonna be here till I die. But I do generally like uh, Adobe software. I have complaints, but. I still quite like this using it. Coinage here. That's big coinage. Excellent. Oh, Vanna. I didn't do anything to earn coinage. Captain Hookbeard. Thank you for the $15. Hey, Moose. My wife loves to watch your VODs. She's had a rough couple of months, and I know she'd freak if she heard a shout out from the man, the myth, the moose. Her name is Kieran. Thanks for the endless hours of entertainment. Well, hey, Kieran. How's it going? I hope things turn around for uh, for you soon. And thanks for watching. What a nice what a nice gesture from Captain Hookbeard. I hope things turn around soon. Months is months is a long time for rough. Uh, uh, roughness, you know, rough, a rough day, a rough week, rough months. Mm. I would just rather have easy months all the time, I guess is what I'm saying. <laughs> Has anyone ever thought of that? Wouldn't you just rather life be easy all the time? It's my original thought. Has it, I can't believe no one's ever thought of this before. What I have therapists in shambles. Well, have you tried just not being upset about that? <laughs> uh. oh God, I'm still working on a windowsill, by the way. Here and happy. Thank you for the three months. Thank you, thank you. The Better Help sponsorship. Uh, what am I working on exactly? So I, I am working in Photoshop. I've got a room. Uh, and I'm putting a doorway and a wall in the back of the room. by like cutting out holes because uh well I'll here no I'm not gonna spoil I'm not gonna spoil it would be it would be so much easier to just show you but uh I'm keeping secrets today I'll show some things but I'm keeping secrets I can always make if I get some time today, I can always make something not for the video, just to show what I'm up to. Have I shown anything? Yeah, I've shown uh, this. I think people really liked this update. And then I also uh, showed this. <laughs> so... Um,
Those are the big spoilers. God, this is taking forever. And again, this is this all this time is for something that's going to be in the background for I think maybe one shot, maybe two shots, maybe. Is this game just fishing? That's how I play it, but there are there's more things to do if, if you want. Give you a heart attack? What I do? Oh, did I do this? Okay. Once the video comes out, I'll I'll point out which which window it was that I was working on during the stream. God, it looks so fucking weird, but I think it'll be fine. I think people will see that and say, that's a window. Or they won't even notice that it's there, which is more likely what's going to happen. Bum, 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 bum. thing is it is going to have a blur on it because it's going to be in the background so it's going to be blurry but i still needed it to look good and this is this is uh the one i'm working on now is something i might reuse uh, i'm gonna be i usually make things uh like stuff for the bass pro shop video and stuff i don't have those scenes anymore because they were just kind of throwaway scenes but i'm trying to i'm trying to make things that i could reuse this time around do a matte painting it's kind of like, I'm kind of am in a way it's digital I would love to do so I'm I'm like I said I'm making a unity scene for uh, one of these which is really cool but I'd love to do like I did with the winner's lounge and have a like a physical set to put myself in sometime I think that'd be sick I think it'd be so cool Lit Slime, thank you for the prime sub. Uh, who asked what? What did I miss? Yeah, I would love to do more practical effects. I have some practical effects in here, um, but not as many as I wanted. I actually, for ambitious as I keep saying that this is, I, I did, I pared it down. Because I was like, this is too much. I can't, <laughs> I can't do all this. I gotta, I gotta, you know, one thing at a time. Oh, what I'm fishing for. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm just fishing sharks. Miniature set would be so cool. I mean, I could use the winner's lounge. If I took the winner's lounge sign off of the top, I could just use that as a, a room at some point overachiever i just want it to be cool and i think i i just i think physical sets and stuff like this is cool Had a $40 monthly subscription running for the last year that you weren't using. Dude, that sucks. I need to go through. I try and go through my uh, subscriptions more often now. I've axed a lot of my monthly subscriptions that aren't work-related. I have a lot of work-related monthly subscriptions, which suck. Happen to see it on your credit card bill? At least you caught it. I mean, it could have it kept going. I tried to use, uh, I tried to use some service that examines your 
your spending and diagnoses your like monthly bills, but it couldn't do it. It was too stupid. It was like, you have no recurring subscriptions. And I'm like, I know that's not true. I know for a fact that it's not true. I know that I have recurring subscriptions. So it's a thing YouTubers at. What are they, what are they advertising? I have no idea what, uh, I don't watch YouTubers, so I don't know what, what's the service? Rocket money? No, it was not rocket money. Okay. Okay, this kind of looks like a window a little bit. It looks like a window. It looks like a window. Rocket Money is that. I think the one I used was Mint. Uh, but I, that Mint is it was closing. So it, it was probably because it, it was probably closing because it didn't fucking work. Mint is closing because they rebranded it into something else. Well, whatever they rebrand it to, don't don't trust it because it doesn't fucking work. Yeah, are they merging to Rocket Money? Maybe I was using Rocket Money. I just didn't know it. Your bank has a feature that does. I wish my bank did that. Sorry, I want to make a miniature set. Uh, yeah, well, I already made a miniature set um, for uh, my bingo series. But I think it would be cool to make a miniature set for a video sometime. I think that'd be pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, exactly. Blue screen into a tiny dollhouse set. It'd be cool to uh, build like a, a tiny little kitchen set. Could be fun. It's not working. Gaslight everyone into thinking it's my real kitchen. I mean, that'd be cool. I feel like that would be really cool. Oh, thanks, man. Oh, thanks, cornbread. I'll keep that in mind. I don't have any plans to do it right now. It would be too much for me right now. This is so stupid. Just, just pick a curtain go with it. No one's going to care. No one's going to see it. Just pick it and move on. We, we, we There's other things to do today. But that 
doesn't look right. It doesn't, it doesn't match. Ah! Change the hoop. I know I'm using Photoshop. I didn't say it doesn't match because it's the wrong hue. They said it doesn't match. It, it doesn't match because the, the curtain rod is wrong. So maybe I make a curtain rod first and then I hang the... Uh, and then I hang the curtain off of it. Or I just put the fucking curtain on the wall and move on. How do I have a wrong curtain rod? Well, I already made the scene from one angle and it has a certain curtain. It looks like a, a, it's a rod holding a curtain. So if I make it from a different angle and the rod looks different, someone's gonna go, wait a minute, he's not really in that room. <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna see. Up until that point, they're probably like, yeah, he's for real in that room, for real. I can't rework the same curtain because it's not its not at the right angle and there's not enough of it on there. Um, I'll, try, I'll try one more thing and then I'm just going to... This one doesn't work. I'm just going with the best looking one and moving on because I have other things I got to do. And again, this is why it takes me so fuck. I spend all this time on one a, li a little tiny thing. These li it's, I, I underestimate how much these little tiny things are gonna stack up. How am I supposed to know that I'm gonna spend an hour looking at fake curtains? Okay, that one's that one's pretty good. That one's pretty good. Uh. That'll work. I'll make that work. I'll, we'll make it work. Looking for the right B-roll of people shaking their heads for the last 45 minutes. Yeah. And it, the thing is, it makes a difference. Like the right footage in the right place. Music and sound effects is another thing that I think I can just do real quick. But you really got to have the right music and you really got to have the right sound effects. It's just not something you can uh, skimp on time. I, I did AI generate the curtains, yeah. But that's that's part of the reason why it's it was it's so frustrating. It's because you can't, I couldn't tell it to put the curtains on a rod, and then when I tried to get it to generate a curtain rod, it generated, liter like literally nothing. Curtain rod, nothing. No, what's that? Oh, never heard of them. Through curtains, no, I need curtains. I need curtains, they shield me. Rolling blinds, which ones are rolling blinds? I don't like, uh, I like I like blinds the when they're big and the, the big chunky wooden blinds, I like. But uh, light gets through the cracks on some of these.
ones you roll up and down. Like with the... Uh, with the... Like a pulley rod, kind of? Or the ones you, like, unhook almost. They roll like a scroll. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. I've never had curtains like that. Okay, we can do a new song. Oh no, we already did. They block out light really well. Oh, I love this song. We used to have, uh, we used to have, like, some type of sun. They were, like, sunscreens, sunshades that rolled down like that on the outside of our windows, like, growing up in Texas to cut down on the uh, electricity bill, the AC bill. But they didn't, it wasn't, like, blackout. Light still got through. Yeah, kind of like window sunglasses. how much uh, progress we've made on fishing today. It's been about three hours and I've gotten to here. Yes, Hero, your, your badge is an unpopped corn kernel. It will slowly pop and uh, become a, a lovely bucket over time. I started, I had just leveled up last night. I le the last thing I did on RuneScape was hit 85, so this is all today. Yeah, in, in about 96 months, you can have a nice, cool silver popcorn bucket. A nice, a quick, quick 96 months. Oh, thanks, Hec Hexadeca. I, I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, work stream. It's... Not what I typically do. I honestly get worried about doing stuff like this because I get worried about being boring. But I hope you guys are enjoying it. I guess I'm just going to get a... buy a curtain rod. I don't know. No pet yet? I don't have... A, I mean, I have a cat. Oh, in RuneScape? I don't have a pet. Could draw I might draw a line for the rod. I'm, I'm going to look at the other picture to see what it looks like. I might just be able to get away with Yeah, I think I could get away with just like a metal, like a silver texture. No, I'm I'm really glad that uh, you guys don't mind because I uh, uh, just immediately after finishing work yesterday, I was like, I don't want to, I don't have a game I want to play. I just want to, I just want to work on my video stuff. I've got, I've got really good momentum with the, uh, the video work right now. I mean, it's, I still gonna, there's still a fuck ton to do, but it's, st it's starting to all, like I have some finished shots composited together, which is, I've got my, digital background, digital set that I made. I've keyed myself out, filmed and everything, and so seeing it start to come together in certain shots is very motivating. Because for, you know, a month or so, it was all hypothetical, in a sense. Yeah, I'm gonna make you stare at the, uh, the window. I can, uh, I'll put out 
like stills of the different uh, things that I made. Not all of them, but... I'm really excited to uh, show you guys the Unity set. I think you guys are going to think it's cool. What are the odds I don't use this window at all? Slim to none. Uh, I will 100% use this window. This window will be used. Because I've already storyboarded in the shot where it's uh, going to be used. Which is part of the reason why I did storyboards... So I don't make a bunch of stuff I'm not going to use. Yes, also the window is my pride and joy. That is also true. Now, if I wasn't sure I was going to use it, I would do a quick, I would do a placeholder thing. I would draw a square and write window and then go about my day until I realized I needed to use it. big red ring around it so I'll definitely notice it. I, I don't know what I'm going to do for the thumbnail. I I feel like I should make it stand out from my usual food thumbnails. I feel like my food thumbnails all kind of look the same and I'm worried uh, you know some of the feedback I got with the Johnny Tsunami video was that my thumbnails all look similar and they, they thought it was an older video so I, I want to make sure I convey that it's something new. Clickbait? Yeah, see, I'm not even too worried about clickbait. I just want I want people to know that it's a new video, like existing bands. Just put new. The thing is, I've already done that. <laughs> I've already done that. There was, I think, the second Brutal Foods video. I, I did put new on the thumbnail. And you know what it did? People did know it as a new video so I'll put a baby emoji in the title that's a good idea maybe I'll put a baby emoji I'll figure it out I'll figure it out luckily it's not a repeat like, it's still, it's a frozen food video, but it's not a brand I've done before, so I think it should be fine. But oh, this curtain rod's looking pretty good. Pretty good. Let me get a drop shadow on this thing. Can I get a drop shadow? Yeah. about a texture overlay? Could I get a texture overlay? Ooh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Sorry. The curtain rod is off screen. I'm not actually showing what I'm working on today. I'm just talking about it. Um... Glimpse of the curtain rod. Fine. Fine. Uh Man, I would show the room, but I'm I'm pretty proud of how the room looks, so I don't want to spoil it. Here. Let me let me get give me a second. I'm going to show it. I'm going to show it, but just the curtain rod. So look away if you don't if you don't want to see my rod. Look away. This is what I'm working on over here. <laughs> this I've got it clearly I've got to attach it to the uh, the curtain, the orange part down there. But that's that's what all the hubbub is about. It's a fucking silver 
fucking rectangle. That's what I've been working on for 30 minutes. Probably won't watch the video now. Uh, no, it's, it's, it's not impressive on its own. It's not really impressive on its own. Thank you, everybody. Okay, now I just gotta connect it. Mm. And again, this will be like blurred out You'll be able to see it. You'll be able to say, oh, there's that, there's that rod. Uh, but it's, it's really not going to be, it's not like important. <laughs> it's not an important part. But so it goes. You know, that's what you do. It's like, it's like. Uh, it's like how I painted my my face as Garfield for the last one, and it was only there. <laughs> it was it was only there for uh, one line. Uh, that's how it that's how it goes. It's not so important. Why am I spending so much time on it? Because it's got to look right. Because it's got to look right, or I will, I, I'll, uh, I'll freak out. It's the little details. It's the little details. I'm, I'm very. When it comes to like videos and and movies and shows I'm so picky about really little details that nobody gives a shit about uh, and this may seem like a dumb thing to spend a lot of time on but it's about the complete package spending time here is really gonna you know help bring the shot together and I think a lot of the draw, even like just for my food videos, I think a lot of the draw is that I do spend a lot of time in areas where other people might say, oh, well, that's not that important. Yeah, I'm very meticulous, yes. And again, uh, this is probably going to be a scene that I can reuse, so I want to make sure I do it right. Do I have OCD? I have whatever you guys want to say that I have, all right? If, if it makes you guys feel better to say I have OCD, go for it. I don't really care if I have OCD. I just want the curtain to look right. obsessive curtain disorder that is probably uh, closer to the truth there boom boom okay okay now I need a potted plant I think I have one purchased already
it's gonna work because I don't want to buy a new. I don't want to buy a new fucking plant. I bought so many potted plants stock photos over the years. You like you like it when I slap the bowl. <laughs> Who doesn't really? And you know another reason I'm so fixated on this fucking curtain is because normally, like for the past couple of years, this is the kind of thing I would I would tell myself I have to not do to meet a brand deadline. No, I'm off I'm off the curtain rod. I'm still working on the windowsill. I'm putting a plant on the windowsill. But I actually have a, a chance to to be as meticulous as I want to be here, and I'm I'm taking it. Need to combat writer's block. Dude, writer's block sucks. Writer's block's a scam. Yeah, just don't have it. <laughs> I like that advice. Just don't have writer's block. I <laughs> being more creative. I love that response. I'm going to try and remember that response. Have you tried being more creative? I got a little tiny plant for the windowsill. I did notice that the the color of the windowsill is wrong, so I might need to fix that. No, not hue. It's not the wrong hue. It's all. It's like it's, I'm not gonna be able to fix it with a hue slider. It's a. It's like a brown. I need it to be like a white. Maybe I can, uh... Hold on, hold on. Here, let me fish some sharks for you guys. trying to interact with RuneScape on Streamlabs because I have both of them over here. What is big chords? Ooh. What the fuck did I do? Oh, oh, I know what I did here. Oops. What's, where did co why are we I was gonna say where, where did cocaine from come from but that's not what I'm asking where, where, why are we what is, where are we where, what are we talking about cocaine for Stephen King a oh, writer's block okay okay Would I be able to get this uh, video done faster on cocaine? How do you guys feel like I would be? Would I be a good cocaine user? <laughs> Will you guys give me permission to use cocaine to work harder, please? <laughs> would you guys back me up on that effort? <laughs> I'm nervous.
don't think it's a good choice. But what if I really wanted to? Would it be, <laughs> would it be okay then? Okay. Is there a Gerbert episode about this? That would be awesome. <laughs> that would be awesome. Gerbert wants to work harder. So he starts doing cocaine. I would watch the shit out of that. Email Gerbert's creator. Hey, I was I came up with this new idea uh, for a Gerbert episode. Stu could be the drug dealer. Stu could be the one that uh, hooks him up. How long am I planning on being here? I mean, I feel like I'll probably be around for another 10, uh, 20 years before I'm you know, start thinking about checking out. Oh, the stream. Um, a, a while. A while. I still have a ton to do. So I'll... I'll uh... I'm not planning on going anywhere. <laughs> More morbid than intended. <laughs> I honestly, what I should be doing instead of fucking with this uh, scene, I started messing with the scene because I needed something to do while the thing was rendering. I should be storyboarding and uh, rewriting a few scenes, but I must finish this screen or I will have an aneurysm. So one thing at a time. No, the on-stream aneurysm isn't until, you know, that the 10 to 20 years I was talking about. <laughs> I've trained for the aneurysm. funeral stream I mean it's gonna happen I mean not with me but there there's gonna be a funeral stream that we're gonna tune into I guess that kind of stuff has already happened huh there's been been public funerals for big figures and a live stream of funeral my funeral will, will be live stream I don't want a funeral don't let me have a funeral. What, are people going to stand around and be like, oh, he's dead now. Aren't you sad that he's so dead? Remember when he was alive? Now he's dead. Just let me have my aneurysm and, like, get on with it, you know? Yeah, that's kind of like Queen Elizabeth's funeral. That's kind of what I was talking about when I was, like, big, uh, like, streamed funerals. That's, our, that's already happened. I feel like that's a brutal BF decision. It's a, it better be a my decision. If I say I want my funeral to be a thing and somebody else does says something else, I'm gonna haunt the fuck out of them. They will be haunted, guaranteed. Don't give living people chores for dead you. I, I'm trying to. I'm trying to say no funeral. No funeral's not a chore. That's a. Uh, 
That's whatever the opposite of being given a chore is. Listen, by by then, there'll be a Brutal Moose AI model. All my content will be AI. I'll probably die and you guys probably won't know because I'll just keep streaming. My robot will keep streaming. How does AI eat shitty frozen food? You don't even have to eat it. Just don't eat it. Just give an opinion. Just fucking make it up. This is gross. This is not gross. I mean, you can only really say one of two things <laughs> in a variety of different ways. There's really you're only really only saying you know one or two things. stream pre-recorded. I'm trying out the new AI model. <laughs> I, what was, I was just looking in, just checking to make sure you guys are behaving out there. done with this windowsill. I've changed the windowsill to a white windowsill so it matches. I don't even know what the fuck this layer is. Oh, okay. Bone dance. Everybody behave during the bone dance. I don't want you doing what you what you what you're thinking. Shelf, a little shadow, a little shadow for the shelf. There we go. Feel, <laughs> it's too much. Feel like I'm. Not wearing enough clothes, even though I'm fully dressed. I think I think everybody should be wearing two sets of clothing anytime they tune into my streams. Uh, just across the board. Oh my god, I think I'm finally done. Plants a little fucked up. Uh, more exposed than you are. Well, that's just the nature of Twitch in uh, 2024. I gotta, I gotta give the viewers a little bit of sexual appeal. That's why I'm showing off my uh, elbow pit. What is happening? What? What is... Oh, okay. I think my... 
I think I have smoothing on on the paintbrushes. It's freaking me out. What is going on? Hot tub stream. Sims hot tub stream would be kind of funny. If I streamed in the hot tub stream category. Pixel grid. Fuck the pixel grid on Photoshop. Why the fuck does anyone use pixel grid on Photoshop? What is the point? What's the point? I can see that they're pixels. Why do I need a grid? People who need pixel precision. I need pixel precision though, right now. And the grid gets in my way. It's like I'm looking at my picture through a screen door or something. We'll be adding the essential guide to chips volume three to my foods playlist. Probably. Eventually, yeah. I I uh I didn't add it because it was making the the performance of the other videos tank. I think dubbing that video, I think, confused people. Uh, there were people that were like, I just thought the audio was was off. <laughs> Which is, I mean, that's fair. I did dub out of necessity. Okay, I think I can get away with this. I'm going to try and not make it perfect perfect. Okay, so I have the plant, I have the window, I have the curtain. I think that's... That looks like shit. Uh, mm, kind of plant. It's like a little potted plant with the big, uh, the big fat leaves on it. I don't know what it's. I don't know what it's called. It's a plant. Those of you that are working on projects as well, I hope it is going smoothly. It's going pretty smoothly over here. I didn't expect to spend this much time in Photoshop, but it is something that must get done. Ooh, done with cleaning. That sounds nice. I'm doing ADR? I don't have any ADR to do today, no. Working on your job, it's going fine. That sounds maybe like it's not going fine. Okay, we're, we're moving on from the bone dance. Animating? Oh my god, animating is uh, time consuming. Yes, uh, yes, I am actually working. <laughs> Yeah, a RuneScape is over here on this monitor. So anytime I'm looking this way, I'm looking at my, uh, I'm doing video work. Custom RPG Steam extension. Sounds involved. Oh, that makes sense, Lupin, that makes sense. Okay, fuck this plant. I'm done with it. It's done. Oh, now more. I can't carry fish. What the fuck is that? Some bird? 
Working more creative endeavors. Everyone talks about doing cool things, just tired so often. You do a lot, Lupin. Oh, it's a, a Varlamore pet. I always want to say Valamore. I might just start saying Valamore even though I know there's an R in there. I might just start saying it that way anyway. Okay, is this done? Hold on, I'm gonna go grab I need something to eat. I'm gonna go grab something real quick. I won't be I won't be gone very long. I get I got uh, I got an applesauce for a preschooler it's like 50 calories is that good or bad yeah girl dinner. I'm just gonna start replying with girl dinner with everything what'd you get girl dinner and then you guys can just like figure it out <laughs> Bento uh, uh, box is girl dinner. List everything is girl dinner, dude. Every everything, even shit that's not food, it's it qualifies. I still don't know or care what the fuck it's supposed to mean <laughs> but every time I say I have food someone calls it a girl dinner it's a vibe oh, oh cool <laughs> it's a vibe You learned the term on TikTok. I don't want to hear it. I don't care. So baby girl, I hear uh, I hear girly a lot. Girly and girly pop. I'm such a girly pop eating my girly dinner. Anyway, I got applesauce. <laughs> Okay. Riz? I have not even heard of that one. I like these because it's like not eating. Because I don't really want to eat. But you just... It's just regular applesauce. I try and eat it as quick as I can so I can't even taste it. Just get the food in there and move on.
No, I don't. I don't know what Riz is. Charisma. I guess it's fine if you say Riz, and you're like twelve. That's cool. I feel old when it's people my age picking up, like, what is, like, uh, like high school, junior high, elementary school slang. People my age saying it, I'm like, what, how, how old am I? Oh, yeah, Riz. I remember Riz from Greece. Yeah, I remember that. Beanbag. Thank you so much for the 12 months. Yeah, Vibes is from the 70s. It's true, the word wasn't invented, but how it's used has changed. Now you just use... I feel like you use Vibe as a filler for when you don't have anything actually interesting to say. That's a Vibe. That's a Vibe. I'm vibing. It's like, well, okay, you just don't have something... <laughs> you just don't have anything interesting to say. That's fine. Hehehehe. <laughs> See, I feel like epic, epic implies something though. Mood would make more sense. Mood, mood. That's so me. That's me. Yeah, that's it's more like that. Okay, I'm done with the scene. I'm done with the scene. Is such a vibe. The scene is such a mood. Okay. I won't show you, but I'm gonna describe this scene to a T. So you'll be able to imagine it. It's like a girl dinner vibe mood. It's got so much riz. I think cool communicates something. It says it's a positive. If I start saying these terms, will they become uncool? And then people will stop. I'll use them more. <laughs> when you use them, you think of me saying them. Uh, okay. I'm done with my girl dinner. Okay. See ya, Bippy. Planning on using youth slang once your nieces and nephews got old? We can be boomer. I'm not a boomer. I'm, I'm a millennial. Hey, all of this. I'm just going to turn the stream off and keep working. <laughs> I'm just going to turn it off. Okay, so this is done, I think. Get it into Premiere, see how it looks. <laughs> munched. Munched is a good one. You filed your taxes? That's nice. I'm putting that off until like day of. I I'll, I think the music did get aggressive there for a bit. Is, is Gaiat like the Hyatt? Gyat? Like Hyatt? 
hotels. Yacht is a butt. How did they, how did, how did that happen? How, how did, how did we get there? Yeah, the Gyat Regency, yeah. Goddamn to Gyat damn to ass. <laughs> okay. I'm so happy to largely be missing out on all of this. Yeah, this will work just fine. Have I seen Skibbity Toilet? I've seen people say it. Uh, I've seen people say a lot of things that seem really stupid, though. So it's not really... It doesn't stand out to me uh, any more or less than anything else. It's a CGI toilet. You're a CGI toilet. How about that? How do we like that? <laughs> <laughs> founding of the memories of the next generation and that's fine I think that's fine again it's more people my age uh, trying to like get in cool with the kids with the lingo is is what <laughs> I just feel I just feel too old to to uh, use these words. I just feel too old. Late game quests? No, I'm I'm an amateur RuneScape player. Forever an amateur. Do kids still say lit? I have no idea. Oh, we should bring back Rafflecopter. Rafflecopter's a good one. I still really enjoy pwned. You just got pwned. Always a classic. So you can use, you know, when you get old enough, you can you can use slang still. You can use silly sounding slang and also not feel like you're trying to fit in with like elementary school ch children. <laughs> Yeah, lead speak. Oh yeah, let's all be random. Let's all <laughs> let's all be random, guys. It was so funny that everybody that was random was exactly the same as all the other people being random. It's random how that happens. It's just so random. Everything was random for a while there. It's so random. It's just so random. Okay. That is done. Uh, it took me fucking for, what is th four hours. Holy shit. But this one background for a shot that will happen once, maybe twice for a couple seconds is done. So great use of time. Good job. Let's see what else I can do. Let's, I need to storyboard. I'm avoiding what I don't want to do. I need to just do it. Now, I, I take it back. I don't know if this is any better than... Uh, I don't know if this is any better than current slide. It might just be just as bad. Uh, where's, where's the shark? I'm so rude. Yeah, I am rude. 
Have they been to the Maple Valley Goodwill? I don't think so. How goes the rowing? I have not I have not gotten back on the rower yet. The rower, honestly, physical health at this point is like a, it's like an extracurricular activity for me. I got to make time for it uh, around all the work. But my plan is to uh, hopefully start rowing next month on days I don't stream. I think that's going to be my goal. The old-fashioned treadmill? I don't think... Isn't treadmill supposed to be not great for your knees? I, I went with rower because it's supposed to be, like, low impact and my knees uh, suck. It's so random how bad my knees are. It's just really uh, random. You can walk. I don't, I don't want to, like, walk, though. I want to actually get... You know, I want to get that heart rate up. Okay, no more random and we're done being random in chat. We're done we're done being random in chat. No more <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. I'm not a mood kill, Chaka. I'm a I'm killing the vibe. Okay. This chat is just so not my vibe right now. Okay, get it, get my chart out. Let me look at my chart. I considered elliptical. I went row because you get the arms too. And it also like helps your back. Man, when I was rowing, my back felt so much better. I have an appointment that needs to be scheduled. What the fuck does that mean? I just went to the doctor. Why do I have an appointment that needs to be scheduled? You, I went to the doctor. I'm not going again. How many times you got to go to the doctor? Okay. No, they're probably... I went I went for a checkup, but uh, also to look at a... I'm getting spotty. I get, I'm getting older. I'm getting spotty. And I wanted one of my spots looked at because it was a scary looking spot. But she was like, no, that's fine. And then they were like, we can remove that spot for you. And so they're probably trying to get me in there to have my spot removed. It is old man Ian. I probably will get it removed. Like when I, you know, when I have time. <laughs> Or sunscreen when I work in the yard? I should. Honestly, it's really not that... Uh, when I'm working in the yard right now, it's not very sunny. Okay. Intro is in planning phase two. How do I get intro past planning phase two? Well, let me look at the intro. How many freckles are on my back? A lot. I, I don't know how many. I haven't counted. I can't see my back, so it's hard for me to get an accurate count. Chat GPT, what is this spot? Yeah, I'll just, I'll just, uh, have you heard of mirrors? Yeah. How often do you examine your back, Chaka? And you would just say that you examine your back in the mirror regularly? <laughs> I mean, maybe it's, is it normal? Like, do most people say, oh, what's going on back there? I mean, there could be, who knows what could be growing back there, I wouldn't know. I have to look at myself so much for my job just during my daily life. When I'm in front of the mirror, I don't really try to examine it that much. <laughs> I'm much too aware of how I look.
too creepy. I need something less creepy. It's something that seems like a, a work song. Oh no, no. When am I getting my prostate checked? I pee, pee a lot. I asked. She said I have a long way to go. I'm not, I'm not nearly old enough for that yet. How did I put it? I think I asked her when I was getting the special finger. That's how, I, that's how I phrased it. I said, when do I, when do I start having to get the special finger? And she was like, you've got a ways to go for that. I'm like, okay, thank you. <laughs> I panicked. My mid I didn't know how to ask it. I got, I, I began the question and I had to come up with the term mid asking. I'm sure I made a great impression. Just say, you, you can say prostate exam to your doctor if that's what you want to do. I said special finger and it was, <laughs> it was, everybody knew what I was talking about. So it wasn't a problem. <laughs> Okay, so I need... This is actually going to be kind of hard because I can't listen to the audio, so I don't know... This one is loud. Shut up. Not Country Jig. Courage? Listen, I'm never going to claim to be graceful with my words. Memorable with my words occasionally. See you, hero. Yeah, good thing my job isn't public speaking. Good thing my job also isn't food reviewing. Because once again, I've spent months, a month on a, a food video and have yet to eat the food. Describe any aspect of me as graceful. Uh, that's a good question. Not really. I don't think I don't consider myself that graceful as a person though, of a person. Though. I am gonna eat month old food, but it's it's frozen food, so it's fine. Do I think I'll like the food? Maybe. Am I excited for the food? No. No. I mean, I was just describing how I like applesauce packets because it's like I don't have to eat. I'm, I'm not... I get excited for dinner. I get excited for dinner. Just eat dinner every time of the day? No, dinner's only at one time of the day. What time is that? It would be, uh when I'm done with work or when I'm yeah when I'm done with work then I can have dinner okay I'm trying to decide if I need to refilm any of the stuff that I filmed for this scene it looks yeah 
yeah, yeah. I need to redo this line. I can fix it in post. I don't think I can. That's why I got to do a reshoot. song. Enjoy your girl dinner. Anyone who is, is uh, eating any food of any kind, I hope you enjoy your girl dinner. I'm having a man dinner. I don't even know what that could be. Yes, Panero, do Panero does count as girl dinner. Because it's literally any food. As long as you're eating food. I'm having uh, Costco yakisoba for dinner tonight. I'm very excited about it. I really like their yakisoba kit. I do not eat Domino's that much. I went through a Domino's phase, especially when uh, when uh, the kitchen was out of commission. We ordered in a lot. But I really have not been ordering that much. I had Domino's a few days ago, uh, but that was the first time in quite, quite a while. And it was just to take advantage of the half price, <laughs> the half price weekend. I was like, ah, we got to do it. Yeah, you did. You did. It was a it was a good deal, Snooze. It was a good deal. I haven't tried Little Caesars yet, no. Dude, you might be right. The pizza party maybe killed my you know, it slowed my Domino's obsession. If I do enough pizza parties, eventually I just won't I just stop eating altogether. Okay. God. There's some footage in here that will not be used. <laughs> Save that much. There's some footage in here that is going in the trash. Will never be seen. No, not nudes. No, not feet. You guys are all about the feet, huh? When I describe my uh, my audience to uh, you know people who ask, people who are interested, future advertisers, I just tell them they're a bunch of foot fetishists. That's my main <laughs> my main uh, audience. <laughs> Santa's taking notes. You guys are getting no presents. Oh, fuck. 
Fuck! I'm gonna have to do reshoots. Fuck! It's true, Cosmo does, for some reason, have two different feed emotes. It's an interesting observation. <laughs> Appreciates the VOD Watcher shoutouts. I love the VOD Watchers. I got a lot of, uh, a lot of VOD Watchers. You know, I was checking, uh, analytics the other day just because I was interested. I'm pretty sure my female viewership on the VOD channel is like 44% or something. Like, nuts like that. Which I thought was kind of cool. I wonder if it's the Nancy Drew? Yeah, it's very good for YouTube. Someone banned the feed emotes. I don't know, can you ban an emote from your chat? Oh, yeah, they like watching me eat girl dinner. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I just thought it was I thought it was an interesting t statistics. We used to we used to trade uh, stats like that back and forth and be like, oh, what's your uh, what's your ratio? How's the ratio? But it was never. I mean, this is. Uh, very good. What up, Danny? What'd you get at the grocery store? to bring up the female viewership. Oh yeah, you got groceries. That would make sense. That would make sense. Okay. Okay, shut the... Shut up. Everybody shush. Everybody hush. Uh... How is this going to work? How is this sequence going to work? Yeah, you can talk again. I just had to think. I had to think. So basically, for all all this shit, what I'm getting to today is that I, I filmed a bunch of stuff, um, and I'm getting everything in place and trying to think because some of the some of the ideas you get down don't translate, and so it's like, well, how do I make this shot work? How do I how do I get from this shot to that? What do I got to do to get from point A to point B here? I do love a star wipe. Star wipe is good. It's might confuse people if you use it in the middle of a scene, but sometimes confusing people is, is worth it. Sometimes it's a, it's not a bad idea to confuse people. Oh my god, this is not a flattering angle. Bum, 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 bum. Anybody else working in Premiere today? Anybody working on video stuff with me? Or are we all just uh, crocheting? I'm 
drawing, assignments, drawing, writing, crocheting dishcloth. That sounds nice. Boring visual for work. That that was me making a curtain rod earlier. Writing. I'm going to get to writing here in a second, and then I'll probably really get quiet. I will say this background that I worked on, I'm pretty pleased with it. Struggled with it for longer than I wanted to, but I think it was worth it. Maybe. I don't know. InDesign. Which one's InDesign? Is InDesign for, like, flyers and, and printouts? Layout one. Okay. That's cool. I liked doing that stuff in uh, computer class. I liked when we had to do, like, flyers and shit. Use it for books. That's cool. Would much rather be in there than Illustrator. I think Illustrator is my least favorite one. Fuck Illustrator. And it's not just because I don't know how to use it. It's because it sucks. <laughs> we got an AI that can turn... Uh, like non-vector stuff into vector? Wake me when that happens. Illustrator's your job. It's so confusing. I mean, it's good that it's, it's you know, it's confusing, so you gotta hire people to work with it. That's good for you. I always get an Illustrator, I'm like, why does it, why does it, why are the hotkeys different than Photoshop? Why are the hotkeys different than Photoshop? And the answer is, well, because it's a different program and does different things. But in the moment, I'm just like, fuck this. <laughs> Get me out of here. Get me back to Photoshop. Uh, stream is just going until I'm I'm done with it. I don't have a plan. Well, I'm just I'm just going with it. This Illustrator and high school yearbook. Oh. I always thought being on yearbook seemed. Uh, pretty fun. I was never a yearbooker, but it was the closest thing to like an extra media class. Like I was always jealous of uh, like high school depictions where they had like the the kids did the announcements. They got to run camera for announcements and shit like that, or film classes. I was always jealous of shit like that. Yearbook seemed like the closest we had uh, to something like that. You wrote horoscopes? That's cool. Take photos for your book? That's awesome. Yeah, I never did it. I don't know that I would thrive there. Collaboration is not my best area. As much as I should do it more, part of why I don't is because I'm not always good at it. I'm not always a good collaborator. More of a micromanager than a collaborator. Ooh, dark room in a real film. That's badass. I've, I don't think I've ever been in a dark room before. Are there special, like, are there special chairs that you can use on a green screen that you can key out and still see what's behind it? Like a transparent chair? Would a transparent chair work? Are there transparent chairs? Is that a thing I can buy? Would it, like, would it key out, though? You gotta make a simple platform? Yeah, see, I'm using... What I'm using for right now is a stool with a, like, a cloth draped out of, over it. So you can key the stool out. The problem is, you know, like, my legs are blocked by the stool, so those don't... 
they key out part of my legs too. It'd be interesting if I could sit and still have the whole body. Maybe I should just like squat down. <laughs> Mask over the layer. See, I just want it to look like I'm sitting on air is the thing. Holy shit. Dude, it is pissing buckets out there. God has taken a massive leak. That's what we used to say uh, back in church and when it would rain a lot. God's just pissing everywhere out there. <laughs> Don't describe rain that way. It's too late, Mo. It's too late. I already did it. Okay, this... I don't know that this is going to work. I do complain about how the chat says things. Because you know how the chat would say it's raining outside? They'd probably say it's super girl dinner out there. What a vibe. I'm just right now I'm looking at blue screen footage of myself standing up and walking off camera. I stood up and I walked off camera like 15 times and I'm trying to decide in which which cut did I stand up and walk off camera the best way? Should save. If I randomly disappear, it's probably it's probably like an outage or something. I get nervous when it rains. <laughs> you just drop it like a stone. I don't care. Let him leave. Let him leave. Wind up Marlith. Thank you so much for the two months. Get nervous when it's windy. Yeah. I just don't want. I mean, my second biggest fear is that a tree will fall on me and I'll die. And then my first biggest fear is that a tree will fall on an electrical line and I won't be able to work for like a few hours. One of the things I got sent recently in a fan mail is getting featured in this video. Is that cryptic, cryptic enough? Don't have backup power for my laptop. I'm not on my on my laptop. I'm on my uh, uh, personal computer. It's not the Raisin Collection, no. <laughs> not this time. Who knows? You know, the Raisin Collection could pop up in a different uh, video. When I do Raisin Reviews... <laughs> Brutal Foods Raisin Reviews are going to be the next big thing. Okay? Fan Mail Backlog? That's not what I'm working on currently, no. But I've got to finish that before... Uh, Bingo starts, which this is me shaking it out of my head so I don't think about it right now. Get out of there. Don't think about how you got to edit the fan mail videos still. Get out of there. I 
I'm editing the, uh, right now I'm going through the footage where uh, this came from. <laughs> they, they, I feel like my eyes look pretty big when I decide to open them. I got like lazy eyes. That's when I. That's that's me looking shocked. That's like, oh shit! I actually got to open my eyes more than halfway. <laughs> Are you writing a are you writing a paper about the Barbie movie? Is that why you're thinking about it analytically? Skin regimen? Oh, I wash my face when I take a shower. That's my skin that's my skin regimen. No, no. I, I do have moisturizer. Um, but I just I just put it on when I'm feeling dry. Sunscreen sometimes when I'm outside the two two times a year when I go outside, yeah. Let's, uh, Crystal Sword. Dude, it's already been four and a half hours. Dude, it's almost three. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm still going, but there's gonna be a point where I'm gonna have to turn off the stream and really die. Probably when I start writing, I don't think I'll be able to chat and, uh, write it. Or maybe I'll just ignore you guys com completely. So the, you've seen the movie at least eight times. Didn't even like it the first time. Writing a chapter for a book. Well, that's pretty cool. I definitely don't miss writing papers about films. Like, even when I was really into film, I, I definitely got tired of writing papers about film. But you know, maybe it helped. Maybe I feel like a lot of my my scripts I I put together kind of like uh like a essay paper. Analyzing films is more fun than making them, except the editing part. Yeah, I haven't made a film, so I don't know. And that's a, another thing with like the collaboration. I like the idea. Maybe if it was someone else's thing, I would be into the idea of working on a, a film and collaborating on that in that way. But I really like, I honestly like working, I, I like getting to, to do all parts myself. I'm not crazy about showing up on camera. But so it goes. I'm less, less crazy about the idea of like directing somebody to act. What game was chosen from the survey? Uh, the sur There's a new survey, Dreamy. Thank you for mentioning it. I should. It's been a little while since I mentioned it. There's a second and final survey at brutalmoose.com slash survey. So if you would like to uh, influence the Bingo XP season again, brutalmoose.com slash survey. It'll be there uh, for the week. Uh, you should be able to... Hold on. Can you do... Okay. Okay, I did set up. There is a there is an exclamation point survey. What happened to the last survey? Well, I used it to make this survey. Okay. 
I think I'm just going to have that URL always redirect to any surveys. And if there's not one running, it'll just, I'll make a page that says, no, no surveys currently. Previous submissions not count. Uh, they, they, they have already counted. They have already counted. This is a fresh survey based on the last survey. Uh, you can choose as many of the games. You just get the one submission, but you can choose as many of the games as uh, you like on the list. <laughs> yeah, it's it's that's what I that's what I meant to say is it's a based survey. That's what I meant to say. Yeah. I don't see a privacy policy. It might actually have one, right? Based on what? Based on the based on the first survey. <laughs> survey is based on the first. I, I changed my mind. Nobody go to brutalmoose.com/survey. Okay, nobody just nobody go there. Feel free to request the same game, yeah. I mean, if you like the game, you should vote for it, uh, even if you submitted it last time. Okay, okay. Think, think, shut up, everybody, shut up. Let the man think. Okay, you can you can resume talking. For now. else we got here so dangerous so dangerous I want to do it again How do you tell what games made the cut? Well, I haven't even I haven't even totally specified what this these surveys are are for. So all all we know for certain is that it is a survey. It wasn't a dangerous reference. I think it was a David Guetta Guet David Guetta reference. How do you pronounce his last name? Did he do dangerous? Yeah, David Guetta. He was David Gu David Guetta. Yeah, the DJ. He was my uh, when Facebook celebrity lookalikes were popular, and you'd swap your image out. He was my uh, he was my lookalike for back then because he had longer hair at one point. Pronounce Gehetta. David Gehetta. Yesterday, one, two, thank you so much for the 33 months. Thank you, thank you. Gitta? David Gitta, ha. David Gitta, ha. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Not a 
bad song. No, you have not. We have not hit Sea Shanty 2. We're still in the Ds. I've just been going from the top uh, down. But I could do requests later. Shh, don't tell them. Don't tell them, Dreamy. Shh. <laughs> I would never mispronounce something intentionally. I would never. Uh, miss it goes against my moral code to intentionally mispronounce something. Uh, so you you can be assured that I would never intentionally mispronounce something. Never, never. This is gonna work. Oh, see. Oh, I mean, you can't see, but oh, this is this is what it's all about here. All that fucking work. I think it's gonna come together. I think it's gonna come together. Don't have to reshoot this part. Okay, okay. Any hot health tips? Uh, uh, I mean, my doctor said I was very healthy, so I guess lots of dominoes. Eat, uh, eat one meal a day. Work every hour that you can. Don't take breaks. Um... Lots of dominoes. <laughs> Mystical finger. Uh, if you want to be healthy like me, that's what you do. Sit in a chair all day. Be sure to, like, hunch forward. Any cold death tips? We, we covered it today already, but I'm going to fall back on be sure to die on camera, on stream, so you get some of that clout. Uh, or otherwise, what's the fuck? Why'd you die if it's not on camera? Yeah, get, get an aneurysm on stream and don't have a funeral. That is that is That is my advice, yes. Get so many F's in chat. I would want I would want rip bozos in chat. That's what I would that's what I want when I have my aneurysm on stream. Yeah, or my brutal dead emotes, also good. Well, I like this. Now, now it's like getting a peek. It's like, you know, it's, it's how some people fake their death to get to look at their funeral early. Uh, you, We've heard about this TikTok trend. It's like that. It's like I'm getting to glance into the moments after my uh, aneurysm. Just leave the chat and turn on a VOD. Uh, mm. uh, 
know that I like this shot. I can't gaslight poor Mo. He never knows when you're being sarcastic. Well, how is he going to learn? <laughs> Here's a helpful guide. Always. <laughs> Always. You'll never know my true feelings because I bury it under layers of sarcasm. Uh, constantly. Just layers upon layers. Okay, that's... Dark was pretty good. How about Dead Can Dance? Oh, that's great for our current topic. Exactly. If my true feelings ever do come out, I can just I can just say I was being sarcastic. Yeah, that's the that's the plan. Yeah, me too, Claws. I just got back into uh, old school RuneScape again recently because of the Brighter Shores stuff. Ooh, I like this one. Okay, I have... Right now, I'm, I'm literally trying to make sure I have all of the shots good to go for a scene in which I stand up and walk off camera. That's what I've been doing for about five hours now. Can I reenact it on stream? Yeah, when I got to go pee again, I'll, I'll, I'll reenact it. sarcastic I wouldn't be I wouldn't be sarcastic I wouldn't be sarcastic sarcasm is just so ugly on a person you know stunt double yeah I had to I did have to call on a stunt double to stand up because I was afraid my knees would explode if I stood up too much so I did get a stunt double for that part yeah Yeah, yeah. Looks good, looks good. And I need... What is... Wait a minute, what is... One of these days I should do a, uh, I should just try and make a full video on stream so I could actually show what the fuck I'm up to and not be concerned with spoilers. If I went intentionally into it thinking, hey, I'll, we'll just do it all together, that could be kind of fun. Or it could be absolutely awful, I guess, just depending on how things went. Okay. What up, Zomp? I did do some Smart House. I, I did some uh, food video editing on stream at some point, too. I would be more... If, I, if this video wasn't 
um, like a, a, a an adventure food video, I'd be more open to sharing it. If it was just a regular taste test video, um, I'd probably be showing way more off. But since it's an adventure, I wanna I wanna keep I wanna keep some of it secret. How does one describe a chair? It's... It looks like you could sit in it or something. Yeah, that's the thing. All the It's got four legs and a seat. That's just every chair. I don't even remember what color it is. I should look up what... I think it's green. is green. So that's a good spoiler. I'm sitting in a green chair. Uh, I hope the video has not been totally ruined for you now, but... Dude, everybody who wants to take a stock photo of a chair takes a picture of the front of the chair. How about we see the back of the chair, huh? So interesting how many, when you search Adobe Stock now, a lot of these you'll just search... I mean, I'm searching for chairs, right? A lot of them are AI generated. Like they're mixed in with all the other stock photos and you can't really tell unless you mouse over them. It's so bizarre. That's kind of the back of a chair. That could work. Yeah, that one's AI as shit. That's AI, yeah. Don't like that. It's weird. I think you can uh, you can filter it. I'm sure there's a filter. You can filter them out. Uh, for right now, for what I'm doing right now, it could. I, I don't care if it's an AI chair. I don't give a shit. As long as it's the back of a chair that looks similar, I, I'll take anything. I think I'm going to have to make do with... Oh, but it's not even close. Eh, mm. like people don't label stuff as AI. Adobe's uh, definitely, I mean, they definitely label it. I'm interested to know how, like, I feel like background music, like AI generated music is going to be more prominent. Bum, 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 bum. None of these chairs are right. None of them are right. Mm. 
If anyone's out there, uh, if any of you are stock photo uh, professionals, take the take a picture of the back of whatever the fuck you're <laughs> taking a picture of. Because I don't need the front of a chair. I have the front of a chair. You know how many pictures of the front of a chair there are? They're all the front of the chair. I need the back of the chair. Let me see if I can get... <laughs> hey, Toasty. Hey, who knows? Maybe one of the 360 viewers works in stock photos. We can never know. Look up the same chair on Amazon for a 360 view. I could do that if I could if I knew what the fuck chair it was. I I have a chair that looks similar. I might just go take a picture with my phone and use it. Cause I think it I think it would probably be easier than this. The thing is the chair that I'm talking about, for all I know, I don't I don't remember I think it was a real chair. It could have been an AI chair. I'm not totally sure. take a picture of a chair. Wait, no. Wait a minute. No. Don't let me go take a picture of a chair. Fuck the chair. I will I'll deal with the chair later. I can do other things. I don't have to do the chair right now. Fuck the chair. Uh, what's the status report out there? The, you guys that are also working on stuff, how how is work going out there for for those of you? Is it going smooth? I'm hitting a bit of a wall. Gave up. Slow. No, I'm not taking. A, I'm not taking a break. I mean, I'm taking a brief break right now, but I'm not taking a big break. Sketching, snack, fingers hurt. Don't want to talk about it. It sounds like we're all deep in the creative process. That's what it sounds like. Video game, demo website, yeah. Finish color for frames and doing shading and highlights. That sounds nice. Sometimes it comes easy, sometimes it's a struggle. Boring data entry. Doesn't sound super engaging. I'm getting a little bored because I've been staring at the same fake wall for five hours. What day job would I get if I had to? I mean, like, realistically, if I were to want to get some work outside of what I'm already doing on YouTube, I would probably just try and find a, a remote editing job that I could just do from home. I would, I would be doing the same thing, just... Uh, I gotta change the song. I would be doing the same thing just for somebody else instead of working on my own stuff which would be you know easier in a lot of ways watching the stream for almost five plus hours not sure you understand the appeal of runescape well currently it's a nice it's just a nice background something to be doing it's kind of like i'm playing a game but really i'm working 
you know? And then even if my progress is going slow in work, hey, at least my fishing skill is... Look at how much fishing skill... I got all this today. Look at that. You can't put a... You can't put a price on that. This is spooky. This is too scary. like the endless RPG grind. You know, I started finding myself enjoying the uh, the dot hack grinding after a while. It was one of the things that put me off of the game initially. I still play RuneScape Mobile. I haven't in a while. I have not in a long time. I'm just now kind of getting back on the fishing grind uh, the past couple days. Has RuneScape increased my real life fishing skills? I can't say, I can't say that it uh, has. I'm fishing 85 currently. Mining grind? I'm not getting on the mining grind, Sean. Let me focus on my fish. Mining grind would be fun if I didn't have to pay so much attention to it. Okay, so I stand up. <laughs> I'm still working on the... So I stand up. Oh! 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 Good. I figured it out. I, I just realized what I need to do. I just realized what I need to do. And I shouldn't have to refilm anything for it. Love a good aha moment. Makes it all worth it. Okay, okay, getting somewhere. I think I know what I need to film for this. I think I just need one reshoot, which is awesome. I thought I was going to need at least two in different costumes, which would have been a pain in the ass, but I think I just need the one. Okay, so now, after five hours, um, see the first list here? It's right here, this top left one, the first orange one that says filming phase two. That one's green now. Or planning phase two, green. So... One down. I wanted to do all of them. Get them all to filming session. So one down. It says the second one I'm done with planning phase, but I don't feel like I'm done with planning phase. It's under the pixels. Uh, the, the things under the pixels are really, they're just saying like scene one, scene two. But I have information about what is happening in the scene, so I remember which one I'm talking about, so I can't show them. But it just says scene one, scene two, transition scene three. Taste test one, taste test two.
Okay, so now I'm gonna double check the title sequence. Ian doesn't take breaks. Actually, I might take a break right now. I, I gotta pee again, so I think I am gonna pee before I do this next step. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Peeing definitely takes, it definitely counts as a break. How it's called a bathroom break. It's in the name. It's kind of nasty in here. I'm going to open my window. Got to get some fresh air. <laughs> Your coworker said make it to work and you thought about make it to pee pee. Okay, I'll give us a new song here. I love the fresh rainy air. Why did these wait a minute? Okay, I gotta I gotta do a test render of my intro here. You're really playing RuneScape if it's not a little nasty in the room. That is that is accurate. That is I, I can I can see that. Oh, you know what? You know what I'm gonna do? Hold on. I'm gonna roll my back out here, but you guys don't get to see. So, here you go. You can look at this instead. I'll be right, I'll, I'm, I'm still, I'm still here. But I'm gonna roll my back out uh, real quick. G tuber. 
Imagine if this was your first Brutal Moose stream. You're not coming back here if this is your first Brutal Moose stream. This is a, it's a really boring, boring stream. The frog princess is in danger. She's, she's a strong woman. She can handle it. She can handle it herself. I'm fishing over here. Am I getting stuttery for anybody out there? Sorry, it's uh, I'm not breaking anything. It's it's doing a uh, it's it's rendering a my uh, my title sequence, which has an excess of effects on it, so I might stutter a little bit here. your third stream you'll be coming back for more well hey i'm glad you like it here we may maybe we will do something interesting on wednesday maybe i'll just do this again we'll just have to see we'll have to see what happens wouldn't take as long if i upgraded my pc it's true it's true it costs money though, man. I hope the PC doesn't crash either. Oh, awesome. Yeah, I'm on Twitch right now. I'm on Twitch a lot more than I am on YouTube. I'm, I'm working on a video right now. Um, but I try to be here three, three days a week. Ribbons89, hey, thanks for gifting that sub to Alucardak. Thanks, Ribbons. Yeah, I stream on Twitch. I'm thinking about moving to Kick, though. I'm thinking about uh, kicking on over to Kick. You guys want to follow me over there? <laughs> I gotta be there with all the old with Bodie. I want to go hang out with Bodie over on Kick. Rumble. Is Rumble still a thing? Kick is the gambling. Is the gambling uh, streamer site. I'd rather be here on the booby streamer site. What was the? Why would they? Why did they name it Justin TV initially? I don't. Th I mean, I I I know Justin TV. I just don't know why that it was named. Was it? Was it just so he could? Was did Justin was the only one streaming initially, and then he like opened it up to other people? Only Justins were allowed to stream. Okay. Okay, I'm almost done rendering this scene, so it shouldn't stutter anymore. Oh, this just in. Interesting thought. Who dares message me? I mean, I, I guess I could look it up, but uh, I'm fishing. I could ask my my fellow fishermen over there if anybody knows why they called it Justin TV. Title, title sequence is tight. More like title sequence, right? Esoteric Octopus, thank you so much for the $2. Quick dono before I fall back to sleep. 
Excited to play Old School RuneScape to the VOD later. Thank you so much, Esoteric Octopus. Have a nice sleep. Uh, before you go, check this out. Uh, I wonder if this would help any possible dreams that might happen. But uh, I feel like you should look at this before you go to sleep. Uh, just for a little bit. <laughs> I'll let you know. <laughs> Okay. Title sequence looks good. Oh, that's why I had it marked as good because it it's good. What up ice monster? Yeah, I only need one thing to film for the title sequence and it's going to involve uh uh, costuming. Well, that's the best way to say that. <laughs> it's going to uh, involve costuming. I must construct the costume. Wardrobe. Wardrobe. It's going to involve some wardrobe. Don't like the sound of the the women breathing in the song? I can change it. I think it's kinda nice. <laughs> I know I'm British, but come on. I didn't even know you were. It just wardrobes. This sounds like a very fancy way of I wish I could tell you what I'm doing, because it uh is not fancy what I'm going to be doing. Okay. I got to I got to think about this next this next scene. The good news is is the the scene I'm working on now is the scene that I built the Unity set for and something I'm realizing is a huge benefit to the Unity set. It takes a while to set up, but if if the angle's not right in footage, I can just go move the the camera in the Unity scene. Oh, laggy, lagging a little bit. Well, Premiere is not responding, so I'll wait for a little bit, see if it, uh... Sorry for any lag that's happening right now. Ooh, that's a laggy, that's the lag. Is my audio laggy, or is just the video laggy? Can you still understand what I'm saying? Ooh. Can I hide my video preview? Ooh, I can. That might help things. Just the video? Okay, cool. Whole stream is one FPS. That's fine, because that's how RuneScape looks like to me anyway right now. Just my computer. I, I clicked on a nested sequence, and it started loading. It was like, well, what the fuck is in that sequence? Let me... <laughs> let me look. Yeah, I'm editing and streaming from the same machine. I thought about streaming from my laptop, but all my audio equipment and stuff is plugged in here. Um, and I'm not really doing too much editing. I've been mostly in Photoshop. Uh, I'm, I'm mostly here to plan. Ooh, ooh, 
okay, I'm... Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'll stop clicking on nested sequences. I'll, I'll just stop clicking on nested sequences. Okay. Well, on to another page of the storyboarding notebook. Love this notebook. If anyone likes to storyboard, I got it on Amazon. It's called Storyboard Notebook. don't like this song it sounds like your apartment buzzer which part bing bong <laughs> what's it about it's a it's a bunch of blank this is what here this is what is uh this is storyboard notebook i probably shouldn't be showing you this because it's a spoiler for the book but that's that's the general idea here's one called doorways it is very helpful it's extremely helpful you absolutely could use it for animation mall videos in the future or arcade vids a uh, pro Probably I don't know. I don't. I should stop saying probably. I don't know. I uh, I really do move uh, video to video, and don't I don't really look. I I can't see past this video currently, but maybe. the book club after Animorphs be for this book <laughs> that'd be amazing I uh I don't know that I'll do a book club after Animorphs book club I mean not immediately after anyway I need a I need a break <laughs> I need a break from the required weekly reading I, I, you know, CJ, I might do an easy video after this. I've been thinking about it. Uh, it sounds nice to do an easy one now, now that I've put all this effort into this one that's maybe halfway done. Movie club. No more clubs. No more. I need, I need the, I need the time back to work, <laughs> to work more. I don't like having this weekly time where I can't do any work. Some might argue that that's healthy to have. I would argue that I get less work done. I am. I'm working during work. This has been great, honestly. It, this, it's. I can't believe it's been five and a half hours. See ya, Chaka. Wouldn't work to be me resting. Not really. No. Rest is like when I'm asleep at night. Oh, wait, Chaka, Chaka, wait a minute. Hold on one second. Okay, you can you can go to bed now.
Yeah, I've been sharking for five hours. Okay, good. Cool. <laughs> Happy to help, Chaka. Ooh, see, I'll talk to this guy. He's going to give me free XP. Don't like being not productive. Yeah, I hate being unproductive. Sometimes relaxing can feel productive, but usually I want to make, I want to work on something. Jump scares are helping your productivity. I wish they were helping mine. I don't take naps, no. That's right, Sassy. That's right. I would rather, like, stop working early and go to bed early than take a nap in the middle of the day. I feel like if I took a nap in the middle of the day, I'd be sleepy for the rest of the day and then not be able to sleep at night. Okay, we're, I'm looking at this again. Um, so first two are where I want them to be. I need to work on the third one that says I'm on the rough edit. Okay. All right. No clicking on nested sequences. But I do need to see... Where did that footage go? I think it was in a sequence called Day 2. Filming Day 2. Love naps. Sometimes it seems like it would be advantageous to like naps. Censored peek behind the curtain is evil. Hey, it's something at least. Okay, so... Hold on. I need to rub my face. Ugh. I feel like that's how I get my, my thoughts going again. When my thoughts, you know, some people take naps. I just rub my face, and then I'm like, "Yeah, I feel, I feel revitalized now." Took a nap from five. Yeah, what's a normal nap? Those who nap, like, how long? How long is a nap? Got that. I'm looking through sequences here, so I might get a little laggy here again. Got that. Three hours is not a nap. Hour? Yeah, I think three hours is like a short sleep. But at the same time, shorter doesn't feel like it's enough. Like, if you... Are you really that rested after less than that? Nested sequence, nested sequence. Oh my god, nested sequences. So many fuck... Oh, there it is, there it is. Day two filming, baby. There it is. Oh my god. my last little bit of G Fuel here. Don't let me get another G Fuel.
Okay. No, no more G Fuel. No, I don't need eye, eye drops. It's not, it, my eyes aren't irritated. It really is just like, it's almost like psyching myself up. Like I need a good face rub to get the, the creative energies moving. I'm not high now. I don't know that that would help in this current situation. Please more uh, frozen food reviews. That's what I'm working on right now. PNG. I am actively editing a frozen food reviews. What flavor G Fuel? It was raspberry lemonade. I only drink the lemonades. I don't like the other flavors as more. They're they're good. They're they're very close to what I expect a lemonade to be. I feel like the other flavors taste a little odd. Whereas lemonade, it's like okay, yeah, that's a that's a lemonade. <laughs> yes, hype. I meant to say hype sauce is the name of the flavor. Hype sauce. Uh, you guys know I like to get hype. Uh. You still haven't gotten yours in the mail yet? What flavors did you choose, Mo? <laughs> no, Cosmo. <laughs> oh, I, oh, I, you know, I did try the peach rings, yeah. It's okay, I mean, it tasted like a peach candy. Call Ball 88. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, thank you. Oh, you got the lemonades? Good, good. I'm looking at shots of myself. Here, I'll recreate what I'm doing in this shot right here. Spent a time, a lot of time looking around on the blue screen. I wish, uh, so I, one of these, one of these, I'm wearing a hat in one of these costumes. I wish my head wasn't so fucking big. Every hat that I put on, when did my head get so big? I feel like I used to fit into hats. What up, Matt? Uh, nothing, nothing up here. I'm just talking about my fat ass head. My big ass noggin. I don't think you should be able to call a hat one size fits all, unless that's true. <laughs> Working out at the library? I, uh, I can't remember the last time I've been into a library. How big is my head? Too big. I don't know. How do you measure how do you measure a head? Large. Larger than large.
I feel like too big to fit in one size fits all hats is a pretty good, <laughs> pretty good descriptor of uh, my head. Basically, if you're sending something to me to wear on the head, and you check the reviews, and anybody is saying it's too small, it's probably too small for my head. Most of the beanies that I own, uh, I got timed out. Most of the beanies that I own, I have to stretch out to fit, uh, on my head. Okay, where were we? We were in G, I think. Oh, wait, no, we hadn't made it to E yet. Egypt. Let's just start here. A hat tailor? Can hats be adjusted? Can I take a hat into a specialist and be like, can you make this fit me? I have no idea how long I'm stream planning on streaming for. I wasn't planning on streaming for five and a half hours. What the fuck time it is? Three? Almost four? Out of all the things that I stream, and I'm including Sims, what else? Sims is one where the time just disappears. This is the fastest a stream has moved for me. Uh, this is how I feel when I work, where I'm just like, oh my god, how long did that take? Holy shit, how much more longer? I don't have, I don't have that much time in the day. It's already almost the end of the day. Well, not really, but it's getting there. Oh, MJ's doing great, uh, Luna Girl. No, no complaints. Well, I mean, she is probably complaining that I'm not actively playing with her right now but you know there's I can't, I can't I can't do that all the time yeah Nancy definitely did that too I can get engrossed in a game and time will disappear but it does not move as fast as it's moving right now time is moving way too fast Dinner time for Americans. What are I'm having? Uh, I'm having yakisoba from from Costco. Very very delicious. They're like pre prepared meal stuff. You, I mean, you still have to kind of cook it. The dilemma is that all this footage is supposed to be synced to the audio, but I can see with my eyeballs that it's clearly not. It's clearly not.
hold on. I'm gonna hold on. Hold on. Give me. I need him. I need a minute. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. Back to it. Here we go. This is just a oh wait. Okay. No, I did not. I did not punch anything. I'm too. If I punched anything, my hands would fucking shatter. <laughs> uh, no punching. <laughs> We're ranked number one in fishing for the first week of Old School RuneScape's release. I am impressed. That's badass. What are you ranked now? I have bonitis. I got hollow bone syndrome. My bones. It's a 30 rock bit. Avian bone syndrome or something? I forget what it was called. I have hollow bones. <laughs> Best bit. Dude, I've been... I've been uh, I've been wanting to watch 30 Rock again. 30 Rock has been... I used to say it was my favorite sitcom. I don't know if it's my favorite sitcom anymore, but it's one that I always think I've watched to death. I always think I can't watch it again. And then when I watch it again, I'm like, man, the writing is so tight. It's so good. Got to season two, but fell off. Oh, man. Great show. Big fan. Okay. Kimmy Schmidt was like, eh, I, I, I kind of like Kimmy Schmidt. Um, I don't remember what happened. It, it got to a point where I, I was like, okay, this is enough. I don't remember when, uh, but I think I liked the first season or so. I haven't seen Girls 5 Eva yet, but I want to. Please keep watching the same stuff over and over. That's the only way to do it, man. I feel like a lot of the stuff I watch rewards uh, rewatches. I like stuff that's good and that you can miss details on and go rewatch and be like, oh, I missed that joke last time. Bojack's a sitcom, yeah. I, I dropped off Bojack when it started getting too sad. I did. I like. I watched Shit's Creek. I liked Shit's Creek up until it got really like wedding focused, and then I stopped watching. Oh, I love all three of those. Office, Trailer Park Boys. I haven't watched Malcolm in the Middle in the Middle in a while, but I've never seen Frasier. I'm not going to finish BoJack. I, I I'll just say right now, I'm not going to finish BoJack. <laughs> it's just not, it's not happening. 
Not happening. Okay. Okay. Ah! I just tried to click the pin. That is... That was the pin part of the pin. Everybody Loves Raymond. I don't think I've seen an episode of Everybody Loves Raymond. I like the mom, though. Like the actress. Okay, okay, let me look at the boards I have for this scene already. I need to reboard that. That's pretty good, solid boards. What about the script? What about the script? I have not watched the new Curb Your Enthusiasm yet. No, I'm definitely going to. Right now we're still finishing on cinema. I made it to I made it to the latest uh, Oscar special, and once once we're done with that, I can move on to another show. Script seems pretty solid. It gives me a little bit of a chuckle. That means it's got to be at least okay. 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 Ooh, I like Arrested Development. I haven't seen the latest season of Arrested Development, though. I didn't, uh, I didn't tune into that one. Dark Rye Husbando. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, thank you. Thank you to anybody who's subscribing to this boring shit. Okay, okay. Good to film on that one. Three down. Three out of... Twelve, which I was planning on doing today. I have not seen Big Bang Theory now. Oh, I'm I'm happy that I'm at least good. Uh, I'm good to work along with. Thank you guys for hanging out while I do this. Okay. Number four is ready to be filmed. Number six is ready to be filmed. Number five. Oh my God. Uh, hold on one second. I gotta, uh, hold on, I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. No, I haven't been doing disco balls for the work stream. Okay. All right. <laughs> Wash my hands. I just grabbed another applesauce. I think I'm feeling hungry. Sometimes I don't know what I'm feeling, and I just eat, and it goes away, and I... Well, I must have been hungry. Okay. Where is this scene at? Double dinner. I'm going to eat the... the Costco teriyaki is a sizable meal. I'm sure I will eat, uh, eat plenty. Okay. Ooh, yeah. I think I was hungry. <laughs> I, feel, I, feel, I feel much better. Um, I do, I do buy enough food and, and, uh, to justify a Costco membership. I, I, uh, we hit their frozen section a lot because their frozen section is really good. Okay, where... Where... Where a wear brush? Where is my hairbrush? I do not have the cabbage cape, no. Oh, three things take your whole freezer. I got a, I got a really big freezer that helps. If I couldn't fit so much shit in my freezer, I don't know that I would be as big on Costco, but... Oh, that's cool, 2-H. I hate thinking about groceries and eating. It's such a waste of time. Why, why the fuck do we have to eat? Do we have to eat? Could we evolve past this shit already? Yeah, Costco is a bulk buying store. And you have to, uh, you have, to have a membership to shop there. But what you can't, you can get some good discounts on, on stuff that you buy in bulk. Like I've seen uh, some of the, like the frozen chicken wings that we like to get there. I saw them at the grocery store for like double the price for half a bag or something ridiculous. So it's just, it's not somewhere I can get everything, but the things that I do get there, I get a pretty big uh, savings on. Oh, sorry if it's lagging. I'm looking at a nested sequence again. I know I said I wouldn't do that, but I, then I did. Uh, oh, oh, I don't have to watch these in here. I've exported them. I can watch them. Yeah, Costco has non-groceries, so like good, it's good for like toilet paper, things you're going to use if you buy a lot of anyway. Okay, don't listen to what's about to happen. Just don't listen for a second. Okay, you didn't hear that. Okay. Who 
Who's getting BJ's here? Nobody. <laughs> That's not allowed. That's not allowed in here. Yeah, BJ's is like a, uh, how would, what would you describe BJ's as? It's like a, it's kind of like a TGI Fridays. Uh, it's just got like, like that kind of food. Casual, casual, casual dining. Family restaurant. Okay, so I gotta... Wild Buffalo Wild Wings is a uh, you can get wings and watch watch the game there. Okay. 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 Sorry if I'm just randomly nodding and saying okay and not making sense. I'm I'm piecing I'm piecing puzzle pieces together in my brain and to be rewritten. This is not it's not funny. This is not funny. This is not a funny thing that I wrote. the title the VOD yeah okay yeah I have no idea what I'm gonna title the VOD more stream hey we hit six hour mark six hour mark everybody oh wait no six hour six hour mark everybody we did it Four more to go. Uh, not happening. I would be surprised if I last another hour. Because I'm getting to the... Oh, I hate this. Oh. Oh. I'm getting to that part of the day. <laughs>
wait a minute. Wait a minute. That. Wait a minute. Oh, f fucking. Hold. Oh no. Okay. I might have to change. I thought I was done with my Unity project, my Unity scene, but I might have to change. I might have to change an entire wall? Or like two. Did I. I feel like I boarded it backwards. Okay, Unity is opening. If there's a. Uh, If there's any lagging, it's just Unity's open. Give me a give me a sec. I said Unity scene, not nudie scene. Unfortunately, no nudie scenes. Not in this. Uh, Not in this video, at least. It's true. If I had more RAM, it might be fine, I think. I have no idea if I need more RAM or a better processor, a better GPU. I don't know what the fuck would help. I don't know. You had the video memorized and I started looking at you. I need a new CPU to get more RAM. What? How? how wh why? Real? Do you? Did I mention what CPU I have? Do I really have to get a new CPU? Uh, we might, act, Lupin. We might. I might do another work stream on Wednesday. Honestly, I'm so. I feel. Not behind with this video, but extremely behind. So I might do another work stream. Just we'll just see. Oh, to get that much RAM. We'll see. I'm tempted to just build or buy another machine and make that my video machine, and then leave this one here and make it my streaming machine. We'll just see. Holly's making stuff. Thank you for the prime sub. What you making, Holly? Consumer CPU caps itself at 64. Oh, we'll just see. I can't even I can't even really think about that. Stuff? Well, there you go. Me too. Okay, okay. So behind on stream? What do you mean? Yeah, see, this is too all this computer. It's too much. 32, 128. I'm not going to remember any of this shit. Go to the PopCat event in Seattle over the weekend. I did not. I don't know what PopCat is. Dan Dang done it. Thank you for the 28 months. 28 months. 28. Yeah, I got nothing. Just enjoying the moose streams. Thanks so much, Dan. Okay. I did, I did board it backwards, but I think I can still make it work. 
I really don't want to have to redo all this shit. See you, Ribbons. Oh, I see what you mean, Lupin. Are you caught up now? I think I have 32 gigs of memory to those asking. I'll look it up. Hi, fellow Rob. What up, Steve Butch and fellow Rob? Hey, hey. Thanks for watching my YouTube. I'm working on a new one right now. I'm really enjoying the process. Yeah, I got 32 gigs of RAM, it looks like. Oh, that's cool. Cats for Adoption? No, I hadn't heard about that. I don't really know what's going on uh, in Seattle. I don't really pay attention too much to what's going uh, down in Seattle. I don't I don't make my way down there very much right now. Yeah, I need 32 gigs of room, RAM to play RuneScape. At least. That's the minimum requirement. Okay. Okay. No, if, I don't know that MJ would like a cat friend, honestly. She is she has not been reacting well to seeing the, the outside cats. Okay, okay, top row. Top row is good to film. I think the whole top row is good to do my last batch of filming. So six hours into the stream, I've reached my halfway point for where I wanted to get today, uh, which is pretty... That's why I keep saying someone's going to be done and then push it back. That's that's why. Now, I haven't reviewed Brink. I'd love to at some point. I think Luke and I talk about doing it uh, occasionally, but we, we haven't yet. Oh, no, not this scene. I don't want to think about this one. Oh, this one's going to... Oh. You must have dreamed about me reviewing Brink yet. I haven't gotten to it just yet. Oh my god, no. There's no way this one is getting to where I want it to today. There's no, absolutely no way. It's too... It's too complicated and I don't have... I don't even have all the props for this scene yet. <laughs> Moose breaks down and weeps openly on stream. Oh my god. Oh my god, is that one not ready yet either? No, that's ready. That's ready. Hold on. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. How do I play this? Do I just use Steam? I use Rune Light. RuneScape, you mean? I use Rune Light. Because uh, it's got some features that I quite like. The one I like the most is that you can swap inputs. So normally, when you do this, you got to right-click 
and then click harpoon. Usually net fishing spot is the primary one, but you can swap it, so I just have to click once to do it. I, I quite like that. Okay, okay, so now I'm planning one of the taste tests. And I've never played Raft, no. How's everybody's, how's everybody's projects coming along? Anyone else hitting a wall? Anyone feel like you're running into a wall? Chill out. Chill out. I'm hitting that point. I get a, I hit a point while I'm doing my creative work where everything everything starts frustrating me every everything like every little tiny thing that's not right just oh I just need a second I just need a hit a wall found the solution that's how you do you find that solution it suddenly suddenly feels like you can get a second wind No, I'm not hungry. I just had applesauce, so I can't be hungry. Okay. I think I know what I need to do. Wait. Wait. No. <laughs> plain applesauce. I like the plain ones the best. The, the applesauce that have, has the banana in it is also pretty good. But I, I usually like just the plain ones. I don't really get the cinnamon ones. I don't really like the strawberry ones. You like the strawberry ones? The strawberry ones got a weird taste. Strawberry applesauce has a weird taste to me. My God. Okay, what else can I, I might need to move on from this task. It might be time to hop to something else. I am getting cranky. The end is near, it's true. like I'm oh. I'm mad at my past self for these ideas like I like the ideas but I'm like how did I think I was gonna pull that off how the fuck am I supposed to do that and if I don't do it how am I gonna get from point eight if I have to do it I'm at the point where I gotta I gotta oh
Maybe, maybe tomorrow I just film the six things. If I can film, if I can film the uh, the top half here, that's still a pretty big. That's a pretty big day. That, that's probably a full day actually, because that's that's moving cameras around, changing costumes. That's probably true. I, I do kind of feel like I'm hitting that point where I need a bit of distance, but I'm not I'm not there yet because I want to make sure I need distance, but at the same time I need to make sure that I'm set up to know what I need to do when I uh, return. What's the protocol when you mark something as in trouble? I don't know yet. Uh, this is the first time I've actually planned out scene for scene a video like this. It was the first time I've done it because uh, yesterday I was working. I I I, was, I just hit a point where I was like, okay, where am I? Like I've been working on all this different these different aspects of the video, but I'm all over the place. So I had to take time yesterday and just figure out where the fuck I am. And, and what needs to get done. So, nothing in trouble yet, but I needed something to label if I feel like I've got a problem somewhere that's, like, preventing me from finishing a section. I wanted to have a label for that. How much of my videos is just improv? Um, I mean, the uh, like like the taste. If I'm if it's a food video, and I'm doing like a taste test, those are improv. Like I didn't script my reactions to this food here. Um, for the for the food section, the sections where I'm actually taste testing food, uh, I just have to plan. Like, where I need the cameras to be. And then uh, just need to make sure I have the the lead into that scene and the exit from that scene planned out. But the actual reactions to the food will be genuine. Because uh, I have not, I haven't tasted it yet. That's why I haven't eaten the food yet. Is because I'm making sure I've planned everything ahead. Uh, to the point where I can eat the food and confidently say, okay, this... This will I won't have to refilm this to fit in the video, right? Yeah. Uh Killy, I, I I relate to that a lot. I think some of some of it is I have to I have to stick with things even cuz I'll hit this phase on some videos and I'll I'll bail, I'll quit. Uh, but sometimes, sometimes you have to see a project to the end, even if you're down on it. I'm not down on this one. It's just there's so much to do and it's, it's complicated. But that's part of the fun, you know, I, I like I like that it's so complicated. I mean, I think it's going to be it's going to result in a unique video that I'm proud to finish. Why'd you like it, Eden Ivy? Sorry, sorry, I'm not as open with the process as I could be. I could be showing you what I'm doing, but I just like keeping secrets. I like a uh, surprise. I just talked about it, uh, Jelly Bean. In trouble is would be if there's something that's in the way of me uh, like getting it done. If for some reason I feel like it won't get done or it can't get done, I would mark it as in trouble, but uh, so far Oh, you're good. No worries. Showstoppers is the term you use. 
I like that. I like that. It's like you found a way to take a positive thing and make it into like some terrible, horrible. <laughs> I see, sh I see showstoppers, and I think something very positive. Uh, no, the type of video, it's a frozen food review, is what I'm working on right now. Showstoppers. Sounds a bit more, uh, I mean, in trouble isn't, uh, Showstoppers is a little more literal as to what's going on. In trouble, I mean, I'm in trouble now. I just needed a second. Here I go. Okay. Honestly... Honestly, even though I didn't totally get as far as I wanted in fucking six and a half hours, things are looking pretty good uh, for me to get this done in a, in a couple weeks. I think I can do it. I think I can do it. See ya, happy cats. I did. I had to, uh, I had to deal with you guys also. It's true. So horrible. Such a, such a struggle. <laughs> what up, Thomas? We are, uh, fishing in RuneScape, and I'm working on a video, um, and it's been about six and a half hours, and I'm getting grumpy, frustrated how did I feel about the work stream it's not my first time doing one but it's my first time uh, doing one in a long time I liked it um, you know I, I wouldn't want to do it too much uh, but for today, it was very nice because I really, uh, I really wanted to get video work done. And I, I felt like if I streamed a game, I would have been pissed. <laughs> my, 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 sometimes I can't get my brain off of video work and I'll, I'll do something. I'll go do something else. But I'll be a little shit about it because my brain is still on some problem that like I just can't, I just can't get myself to leave it, uh, and I kind of felt like that. So I'm happy to be able to work um, and get some stuff done. Don't know how creative types do it. It's uh, it's interesting. <laughs> Not always fun, but uh, things rarely are all fun.
My fishing level is 85. And in six and a half hours, I've gained this much XP. Wow. Very nice. Yeah, we, I might do another work stream on uh, Wednesday because I don't want to start a new series because uh, we got Mario Party on Friday and then Bingo starts on Monday. Uh, if you have, if you weren't here for the stream, brutalmoose.com slash survey. There is an updated, a second and final uh, survey for the upcoming Bingo XP season. So if you would like to influence it somehow... Uh, brutalmoose.com slash survey and uh, you can pick as many games on that list as you would like. Okay. Yes, VOD watchers can vote as well. Good point. The I will have the poll or the survey running through the week so there's plenty of time to do it you do have to log in I think to your gmail account or something to take it oh good Chelsea I I uh, if nothing else I would love the things that I do to inspire uh, someone out there to be creative and, and embark on a creative task. This is a, this has been a little peek behind, uh, you know, <laughs> when I get frustrated about food videos and whatnots, and I seem uh, irrationally upset about the process. It's because of shit like this. It's just not always. It's not always smooth. It's but that's, it's, you know, it's kind of like a tug of war. But that's just how it goes. Okay. I did that. Did I do this? Yes. 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 I did do that. Yes. Transition scene two. Uh. Oh, I didn't get there. Taste test three. Yeah. Yes. Taste test three. Oh no, I accidentally minimized everything. I'm not a fan of the shake shake your window back and forth. Everything gets hidden. I'm the biggest fan of that. I'm assuming you can turn that off. Okay, okay. I think, I think tomorrow I'm good to film, finish filming for six of the 12 scenes, which is pretty good. Scene seven, eight, and nine are gonna be tough. And then 10, 11, 12 should be fairly straightforward. Okay. Okay. Well, I think I'm ready to stop stream. I will probably keep working. Uh, for a bit longer, but I gotta do some, like, I gotta print some shit, and I can't be bringing my printouts here and 
letting you see what they are. That's not allowed. But thanks for hanging out with me on this extremely long work stream. I was very productive today. I got a lot more done than I would have had I done a normal stream, so I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. Thanks for chatting with me. Thanks for lurking. Thanks for VOD watching. Uh, just like I'm always watching. I would not be surprised if on Wednesday I do another work stream, but we'll just see. We'll just see. I might... I might want to do something else besides work. I might take a little vacation and <laughs> stream something else. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's let's listen to Sea Shanty 2 as I wrap up. That's a good... I, I did say we would listen to Sea Shanty 2. That'll put me in a, a better sign-off mood. I need to, like, stand up and walk around or something. Oh, I'm just getting frustrated. Ugh. Bingo soon. No pressure. No pressure on the bingo. I'm feeling good about bingo. Uh, I think I, I really think I just need the one more day to finish it, and I'll do that on probably Saturday. Doing it Sunday seems risky, but bingo should start on Monday. And it, it, I'm excited for it. I think it's going to be a great, a great time. Any other uh, last minute goodbye, goodbye uh, thoughts or feelings? I, I wish I had more to say, but I am I'm drained now. I am uh, I feel I feel empty. I have I have uh, I've given the uh, I've given the, I've been hitting the the pedal to the metal on the the creative juices here. So I'm. Yeah, empty. Oh yeah, there that's me right there. Yeah, doing one of these. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll go say hi to MJ. I'll go say hi to MJ and look out the window with her for a bit. And that's that. You know? Okay, well, I will see you guys. I don't want to contemplate mortality. Fuck that. I want to contemplate how the fuck do I get this fucking scene to work? Because <laughs> I didn't set it up right. That's what I'm going to be contemplating. When I go to bed tonight, that's how I'm going to get to sleep, is I'm going to be thinking about this stupid scene. Okay, I'm getting testy now. I'm going to go. <laughs> I'm going to go. All right, I'll see you guys on uh, Wednesday. I hope you guys have a great uh, rest of the day. A good Tuesday. And uh, thanks again for everything, for hanging out. And uh, if I don't see you, I'll just see you when I see you. <laughs> Extra raisins. All right. All right. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Bye, everybody. And now, folks, it's time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.